Yo, you wanna learn how to do a fucking infinite? Amy, Landy, thanks for the resubs, man. I appreciate y'all. No, I wasn't speaking. I, I was just letting No Needs Music speak for itself, because holy shit, it's so good. It's so fucking good. Yeah, that song was Motion Blur. That's probably my favorite song that he's done. It's so fucking good. Oh my god, it's so good. All right. Uh, what up, everybody? It is your boy, The Infinite Dragon, here, and welcome to Final Fantasy XIV Online. Um, I've been persuaded to to play the game by many a people. Uh, the most influential at the moment being Naomi, because she's currently playing it, and I saw dreadlocks when she was customizing her character. So, uh, we're going to go ahead and do that. I'm, hopefully, I, I stick to my convictions and dislike this game. Uh... <laughs> because I don't want to lose my soul to Square Enix. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, you're watching an archive stream. Uh, you can check me out live on Twitch right now. Link is always in the description down below. You can also join the Discord, uh, which I'm there pretty much all the time. Uh, many people literally just being me. There's more, literally, literally a week ago, Mary was telling me to play the game. Uh, so, no, not just you. Um, yeah, so... Uh, you know, join join the Discord, meet me up live on uh, you know, Twitch, all that shit. Uh, if I can find the fucking game, I'll turn it on. There it is. All right. Uh, I haven't done any uh sound setup for this, so if it blasts your eardrums out, I apologize. Oh, y'all, y'all don't need to see that. How are you guys doing today? Yo, how are we doing? No need. I was literally playing your music like 12 seconds ago. You just missed it. I dig the avatar. Yeah, just when I was in uh, lurking in your stream last night, this is what I was doing. <laughs> Naomi, if you want, if you want my bank account information. Uh, you are looking at the wrong bank account because I have no money. Uh... Hey, Nero. Okay, so I was told... I was told these settings. This bitch about loud as hell. Yeah, yeah, you know. A vibrant planet blessed by the light of the crystal. Uh... Amid azure seas, encompassing the westernmost of the three great continents, there lies a realm embraced by gods and forged by heroes. Her name, Aorzea. The annals of Eorzean history chart the rise of a succession of great civilizations, each one enjoying an age of peace, the Astral Eras. To date, all have proven evil. Hello, Amon. I will fix all the settings in a second. Just give me, give me a bit. In the year 1572 of the sixth and most recent astral era, the Northern Empire of Gollumald amassed a great army at the heart of Eorzea, seeking dominion over all. Rising in desperate resistance, the forces of the Eorzean Alliance met their would-be conquerors in the field. Yet, even as the battle raged, the lesser moon, Dalamut, was plucked from the heavens through imperial machination. From its core, 
emerged the elder primal Bahamut who unleashed his fury upon the realm. God, this is so cool. The devastation brought Eorzea to its knees and the era to its end. Five years have come and gone. The light of life still shines upon Eorzea. Man labors tirelessly to raise himself from the calamity's ruin. When gameplay looks like this, it'll be a new era for sure. The realm is forever changed, a stranger to him once more. Yet heedless of what lies ahead, he shall press on. Spurred by the promise of peace and prosperity. Amid this period of great change, an adventurer arrives in Eorzea, one whose tale is yet unwritten. Uh, your fun fact, personal fact of the day, is when I first saw Final Fantasy XIV and I saw like the trailers for it and everything, I didn't read the May little text at the bottom that's like, this is not real gameplay. And, and I thought the game actually looked like this, and I was like, oh shit! Okay, I need to uh, fix these settings, hold on. On PS3? Fuck no. <laughs> uh. There we go. Damn, we got 75 frames? Damn. Alright. Alright. <clears throat> uh, no. No. Nope. Maybe. Nope. Also, maybe. I can't be these other two, I guess. Uh, the aura. Curved homes and beautifully uh, patterned scales. The character as the aura often give rise to speculation that the members of the higher race, native to the far eastern continent of or uh, Orthart, are, in fact, the progeny of Drag. Okay, no, that's it. We got it. <laughs> What does unique mean? Small clothes, what is that? Oh, hello! I am naked now. That's not what I thought that meant. How do I, how do I continue? Bro, there we go. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh... Ooh, that's edgy. But I think I'm going to go with the first one, because it's a little too edgy. Make, make sure you pick the one that I picked. No, I'm not doing that. <laughs> what server did you pick? I was told Aether and whatever the first one with A stands for. Um, creation myth tells the Dawnfather... Uh, no, I said that right. Dawnfather and the Dusk Mother, whom all uh, are, uh, are descended. How does everything sound? Is everything okay? The brilliant white skills. I blah, blah, blah. Unlike his sister clan, Zayla, who bloodied the land of endless tribal conflict, the rain have embraced the total life, uh, total life of embraced the life of tranquility and solitude, abandoning on the uh, abandoning the nomadic lifestyle of their ancestors to settle deep in the valleys of Othar's mountainous eastern reaches. Only a rare occasion will one emerge from the valley mist to seek adventure in the realms afar. Sure, that works. Uh huh. All right. Fine, don't play with me then. I am playing with you, just not the same race as you. That wouldn't be fun. I need to know need to know inches now. The server I picked? Oh uh, no, I, I picked the same server. Uh, 
<laughs> All right, here, we're going to do this. Pale shape. You know, I'm... I'm a black aura. All black aura have big tails. I'm just saying. Sure, that one works. How <laughs> aura have big tails, fam? Hello. Oh, you're very tiny. How you doing, Marv? Good. How are you? I'm well. You're also quite loud. Yeah, sorry. Uh, I, I've been doing dishes and cleaning, so sorry I'm late. How fucking dare you take care of things? I know. I'm the worst. As, uh... Let me go ahead and get you a, a visual. Um, this will be my senpai as well as Nairu in, uh, chat for uh what's going on here um not that i don't trust you nairo but you're portuguese <laughs> <laughs> there you go you should be able to see now go back to the server list i was there when she created hers and that was like yesterday how you doing today ma'am um i'm okay it's been up and down i'm trying to get more shit cleaned up, and I do that for about 20 minutes, and then I have to lay down. <laughs> okay. So, you're an Aura, too, as well, aren't you? I'm a, yeah, I'm an Aura. Who is this? This is the lovely Marvelous Dragon. She's been on my channel a few times. That is too dark. Hello. Man, I wish I had better lighting so I could see how dark this actually is. Uh, so, fun fact about Final Fantasy XIV is that their uh, lighting in this game is sh tits up awful, or dicks down awful. I don't even know what my negative is today. <laughs> um, so if you actually really get into Final Fantasy, I have a friend who has a, a shader mod, and it is the most popular mod for Final Fantasy for Lady. Uh, well, I'll keep that in mind. But if you hate MMOs, then you're probably... You probably just don't care. <laughs> so it's... I mean, I, I'm a giant fan of uh, games looking good. And a game looking good will definitely convince me. I played... I don't like Souls Licks, but I played most of Code Vade just because my character looked cool. Well, let me see if I can do like a comparison for you because I have pictures I still have screenshots from when I first started playing and obviously like you have the one from now uh, there's like a giant difference let me see mm. alright so that's OG Let's see, do I just have a screen cap that's not, like, heavily modded? That's a trick question, I don't. That's a trick question! Alright, that- So the top one is when I first started playing, and the bottom one was from, like, a year and a half ago. Let's see. But I didn't- I didn't make any, like- the one that I sent you before, like, I did some shaders to it, I have different, like, coloring to it, but the bottom one is how the game looks to me when I play it, and the top one, like, it's so weird. I think it's, the game naturally is very blue or, like, greenish, uh, so when you add this shade, this shader that my friend made, it just makes everything the same intensity, makes everything the same tone, so it looks more pleasant to the eye if that makes more sense. I'm not describing it very well, but the game looks insanely better if you use a mod. Uh, <laughs> I, I understand what you meant. Things with a mod. Um, I understand what you meant. I do not see dreadlocks for, for this race, so I'm upset. 
for the female race because I I know I have access to it. That's racist. Uh, no, I think it's a I think it's an open hairstyle though. Actually, now that I think that I don't think I've ever seen a dude with the dreadlocks. I think I've only seen the females with dreadlocks. This is fucking racist, dude. Or it might be oh further down the list. I don't remember. Oh my god, I have a lot of hairstyles. All right, you. The bonus points that I gave it before is being taken back now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So. I don't think you have to unlock it. So. I'm gonna go with that. Is that fucking Jet Stream Sam? <laughs> this is fucking Jet Stream Sam's haircut. <laughs> <laughs> um, on the list of goals I may or may not complete in my lifetime is to make a game that's so animated you can literally do crazy freeform stuff just for the fun of it. That'll be fun. You have some very fun goals to do, to have, uh, lady. <laughs> okay, now we're going with this. Oh yeah, uh, in case you were trying to do like comparison, if you right click on a hairstyle, then that will pin it, and then at the top you can click on like a, a check mark, and it'll only show you the pinned hairstyle, so you don't have to like click on one and then have to hurriedly try to find the other one that you really like, you can just go back and forth easily. I get you. Alright, cool. Did we go all the way? I wish I could just come in tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Sam. I think we're gonna go all white. Size. Oh no, I have lunch. Big old eyes! And then we're gonna go ahead and go. And go red. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's changing the. What the fuck is the purple shit then? It's the liberal ring. You can turn it on and off. So. If. For whatever reason, you're like, man, I really don't like my hairstyle. You do unlock a uh, the haircut place, and with that, you can change your hairstyle, your hair color, the limber eye ring, uh, your lip, and your tattoos for like 2,000 gil. Oh, I can have one. Mm -hmm. Huh. Curious. What is it? What is it? You get some fun shenanigans going on there? I don't think I've ever seen anyone use a lip ring. They're really weird. They're very odd, yeah. Like these, these are some very odd colors. How does everything sound? Is Marv okay? Am I okay? <clears throat> I'm also just hella quiet, so just yell at me to talk louder, and I probably won't. I'll just ignore you. I actually you had to. Uh, <laughs> that's funny. I had to actually turn you down, so I think you're all right. Yeah, I don't think I want this. So.
That's the closest to the red I want I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, I guess. Anyway. Eyebrows! I don't know what that did, but I'm keeping that. Other features. Ooh, that's cool. Um, I can get rid of my eyebrows. Yes, I'm edgy. I'm gonna wear the goth makeup, alright? <laughs> what, what is this? Goth makeup forever. Ah, okay. It's weird that it sits on top of the, the horns. Or the, uh, you know. The scales, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like I said, mods can do wonders. It just depends on how deep in the rabbit hole you want to get. Oh, well, uh, I'm not sure if you've actually seen me play Guilty Gear. <laughs> uh, I don't think anything is the original sound. Like, I think everything. <laughs> I literally had Snoop Dogg as the announcer. Oh my god. <laughs> you to change your rays you can change everything and uh it was at that time that i had a audio bug and if i were to back out it would void my fantasia so i never got to hear what my audio was going to be for my dragon girl and so i got into i'm like at least it's not the high pitched annoying voice but it's not my favorite voice of the ones that you can pick from <laughs> And it's not worth fifteen, no wait, ten dollars to buy another vial Fantasia. So uh mm -hmm. here I am. This is completely arbitrary. It's more for RP, so you can just okay. pick whatever you want. Got a distraction. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, 
Gladiators. Specialized in handling all manner of one-handed blades from daggers to long swords. Single or double edge. So depends on how you want to play the game. Tanks have the fastest Q. DPS has longest Q. And healers have usually a pretty slow Q. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna stop you right there. What the fuck did you just say to me? <laughs> so tank which i forget which ones are tanks because i don't deal in tanks i uh i'm not i'm not a strong willed person to be a tank uh so that's the person that's gonna take all of the aggro and you're gonna have the biggest health bar your everything's gonna hit you and the healer's gonna if it's a good healer they're gonna prioritize healing you uh unless the dps is dumb uh so tanks have a really slow or a really fast Q pop, which means when you need to get into a dungeon or if you need to get into a raid, you will insta pop. You will not have to wait for anything or for anyone. You will automatically have a dungeon. Uh, healers are kind of the same way, except for when the recent DLC dropped, healers, uh, they got a new healing class, so there was is a little bit of a wait but not too bad and then dps you'll wait like 10 minutes just to get into a dungeon just waiting to get into one so it depends on how fast or slow you're wanting to play the game if you don't mind waiting then do dps dps is a lot of fun uh lancer is my dps if i need to play dps which oh my god there's so many different things uh, DPS <laughs> is better for doing main story because you're going to be able to do more damage. You're going to be able to take care of yourself better. Whereas with healer, you can do damage. Things take longer and you're going to have to heal yourself a lot, but you can kill things eventually. Uh, DPS just does it faster. But healer is better for getting into queues and making sure you don't have to wait on dungeons to pop because in order for you to progress through the story you will have to get into dungeons you will have to do that and so if you have to wait 15 20 minutes for a queue to pop just to continue your story that kind of sucks so what i found out is you should have at least two character or two classes you should have a dps class and you should have a slower or a uh, or a faster pop so when you need to do dungeons you don't have to wait so do the tank do the healer whichever is your play style and then do dps as your main story okay uh, is Nairu's my general me, opinion Nero is telling me to start with tank and i think naomi actually chose who i'm gonna be playing with uh actually told me to, it is actually a healer so i think it would make the most sense mm -hmm. to, to go with tank oh yeah um, tank healer combos when you're queued together and the best because you know you're gonna have someone on your side you don't have this dumbass healer that doesn't know what they're doing well both of us don't know what we're doing so it works <laughs> uh so what am i doing here though so you're picking what you're gonna go into i believe gladiator is a tank archer lancer and pugilist are dps i think gladiator and marauder are tank like i said i'm not a uh, I'm not a tank person, so I don't know the tank roles. I'm I'm a healer. I, I know the healing classes. That's about it. And you can marry your healer. You can marry whoever the hell you want. You can marry a carpenter if you want. Um, and today the ship was born. Uh, mm -hmm. So let's... You, so, Naira, you're saying tank, so I'm asking you what I should be doing. Should I do Gladiator or Marauder? Uh, they both have different play styles. I forget which one is the meta, but either one. I mean, the, the great part about Final Fantasy, in my opinion, that differentiates itself from other MMOs is it doesn't matter what you start with. If you don't like it, go get the other starting class for the other class and you can go into that. So if you wanted to start with Gladiator and you're like, this just doesn't vibe with me, go get the Marauder one. Try out Marauder. And if Marauder still doesn't work with you, then try the DPS. Like, y you don't have to stick yourself with one thing. You can, I know people who have maxed out every single class you can possibly be and every single job you can possibly be because that's the beauty of Final Fantasy. Whereas with WoW, oh, I want to be a tank. Well, I have to make one character for, for that. Oh, I want to try a different tank. I have to make another character for that. That's the beauty of Final Fantasy is it doesn't matter what you start with, you can try something else later down the road. No, I don't think I could choose Paladin. Paladin might be a 
a subclass, like, once you get further down. Okay. Because, uh, for a Lancer, you start out as a Lancer, but then you get to a certain point in the Lancer storyline that makes you a Dragoon user. Or you're, you become a Dragoon. Okay. Which is just a really fancy name for a Lancer. Marauder. Uh, Gladiator becomes Paladin. Marauder becomes uh, a Warrior. Oh, I understand. Mm -hmm. um, and Paladins use fucking uh, weapons and magic, yeah? I could not tell you. Like I said, I'm not a tank user, so Nair would probably be the person that you have to ask for that. Uh, sword and shield, and you can hear your party as the gladiators do. That sounds useful. What, is, what do Marauder do? What? What? How Marauder do? <laughs> what that Marauder do though? What the? What? Hey, hey, hey girl, what that Marauder do? <laughs> Big dick axe, and you can hear yourself like crazy at high levels. Uh. I think I want the big dick axe. <laughs> I Marauder think I does have a lot of cool. I'm I'm a, a uh, I'm a fashion person, so yeah, Marauder does have a lot of nice stuff. Okay, what is this disciples of magic shit? What is this? What is this what do do? So that's so disciples of magic is the classes that deal with your mana pool more. Uh, so conjurer is the starting class for healer. There's thermage and arcanist. Those are all. Those two are the DPS. Conjurer is the healer. <laughs> Naomi just got on, and she called me baby Infi. Um. <laughs> so, am I like picking two classes, or am I picking between these two? No, classes? you pick one. Yeah, okay. You pick. So, disciples of war and disciples of magic have two different uh, armors and weapons. So it's just dis distinguishing between the two. So, do you want to go into war or do you want to go into magic? There is no magic tank. There is only war tank. Uh, I think, as much as I love magic, I think I should probably stick with the. the uh, if you want, yeah. conjure. <laughs> conjure is also going to be quick cues and. It's healing. I like healing. Uh, we were playing Stolen Realm. I was a wizard, and then I turned into a healing wizard. Because that's just what I do. Um, Naomi, you started in Sagantis too, right? No? Which, where, where were you at? Naomi, I would play with you. Oh, Dark Knight is a good class. Um, I could actually get you in the call since we're going to be playing. Starting with an A? Okay, that's the, the only other one here is Adamantus. <laughs> yeah, the only other one here is Adamantos. That one. Batman? Yeah. Big dick sword? Yeah, no. A giant sword is. Yeah. Yeah, huh? I don't know what little kid fucking <laughs> didn't want a giant fuck you sword. My VOD watchers, I apologize for the wait, but we doing things. I mean, you can skip ahead. It's a VOD. Ah. Uh, what have you been up to today, Marv? Um, woke up, had breakfast, tried fixing my closet and finally putting all of my clothes away in my closet. And then I laid on the floor for about 30 minutes because I was in pain. <laughs> <laughs> is, it, is it the and women's I, pain? Yeah. Ah. I'll have I to go to check on you later. Alright, Naira, have a good stream. Played some Destiny. I'm cloud. <laughs> apparently that sword is uh, like it's it has to be lighter than what it looks like because everybody picks up that sword so effortlessly you can actually get cloud's outfit if you subscribe for a month or two 
I forget what the veteran reward time is, but once you sub for X amount of days, you can get Cloud's outfit. I see, I see. I actually have a picture of my character in it. Hey, Naomi, did you know that you're very fucking slow? Okay, thank, <laughs> thank you. There you are. Okay. Um... These are the loots. We can't show the loots. You can totally show. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> hey, where's the good? I had to scroll oh, through a five-hour stream, stream sir. <laughs> All right, I'm Oh, it's loading. I was like, "What are we doing here?" <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I get bitches. <laughs> All right. <laughs> nice. I mean, just as long as you guys were on the same data center, it didn't matter what server you chose because you can just switch between worlds. All right. Well, we're, now we're playing the rating game because they're, they're the world's fault. <laughs> Senpai will play with me, I'm satisfied. I play with the- I'm literally here because you wanted me to play with you. <laughs> How long does waiting to you usually take? Um, kind of oh, depends. Because, uh, I've had it where I was in the middle of a raid and the server just shut down and so I was in a 2500 queue. And that went by, like, in five minutes. Uh, fair enough. It, you're it really doesn't you matter. better play with me. Just because you're older <laughs> than me does not make you- does not make you senpai, alright? Yeah, senpai means upperclassman, and uh, last time I checked, yeah. you played the game the same time as I did. Therefore, you're not my upperclassman. So I'm senpai. Yes. Haha. Here. Feel. I played it first. By two days, you didn't even get that far. <laughs> Technically, I know more of the story than you do because I'm like, in terms of story, I'm like 30 hours in because of the. The recap thing I did. So, uh, technically, I'm your senpai if you want to get technical. I'm gonna steal that Feel. mask. Feel. Oh, the Asians? You can't. I mean, you can get masks in the game, but they're pretty dumb. No one more doesn't put your grades higher. That's exactly what that fucking means. What you are. You can be smart at me and still be still be in a lower grade. Are you trying to say that I'm a delinquent? I'm definitely saying I'm dumb and I don't know why I'm here because I don't know anything. Oi, you're right, lad. Let me switch the top hey, where are you gonna be starting? Uh whatever one started with the night. Wait, what are we doing here? Okay, that's how we do it. Where's my fucking wrist pad shit? How did I lose it? It's like it goes in one spot under my fucking wrist. There it is. It's oh on the shit, ground. this is cool. This is a very different intro than what I got. Yeah. You were moaning in your sleep, sweating buckets. Besides, rolling the ship uh, caught your stomach churning, has it? 
Yeah, Naomi, if you did uh, Conjure, you started in uh, fucking whatever it's called, so you're gonna have different cutscenes than each other. You did different classes. Yeah, she was over. Uh, she was over here watching Boogles getting drunk. Uh, <laughs> don't seem like seasickness. Now that I look at you, there'll be either than I reckon. I'm doing this accent much better than I thought I would be doing. Also, we're not even the same kind of vessel. That's interesting. Um, some are more sensitive to this stuff than others. See, we ain't too far from the uh, Vilbrand now, which is chock full of atheists. I'm gonna, we're gonna let that slide. Uh, no need to fret though, you'll soon get used to it. Ugh, might as well have been blooming seasickness. Ship's leaping around like a demented chocobo today. <laughs> I reckon I, uh, I might hit out on deck, get myself a breath of uh, fresh air. Liz, my loins are still far away off, fair way off. In case you were wondering, see as you're awake and all, how, how about you keep me company till we get there? I bet you uh, suck my ass. Them youngins don't care too much for conversation, see? Yeah, they're children. Why would they want to talk to this old ass man? Anyway, pronounce the name, and the peddling's betrayed. <laughs> I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. <laughs> I'm tall as fuck. I know I made myself yeah. that way, but holy shit. Also, we walk like a goober. Ah, I smell that salty sea breeze. Now then, lad, judging by your unusual garments, I say you were one of the new adventurers. Am I warm? Yeah, I knew it. Go wherever the wind blows, seeking fortune and glory. Now that's what I call living. So long as you can avoid dying, I mean. Ain't no secret uh, that the venturing's a risky business these days, especially. What was it that first attracted you to it? Power with more of it to amass fortune. I need more power. <laughs> power, as in power to do good, like protecting the weak and fighting for what's right and all that. Aye, I thought that's what you meant. Well, adventurers uh, do get up into a lot of fighting, that's for sure. You'd never be short of a chance to polish your warcraft in the adventuring business. Once we port, you best make, uh, you best sign yourself off. <laughs> and it wouldn't hurt to join the guild either. Limbs are uh, home to few, so if you're fancy learning how to swing an axe or even sling a spell, you should think about seeking one out. Just remember, there's just remember though, there's more important things than fortune or glo than fortune or glory, such as breathing. Ain't no profit in being dead, and that's a fact. I love how the axe is not touching. That's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> he got knocked on his ass. Ship to starport. Blah, 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 blah. Rah! Y'all are hard shipping me, bitches. Pirates. Bloody hells. Have you no sense? Get below! Nah, I'm good. My man really walked over, pointed, and then ran away! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no. What's this world coming to? Pirates are fi uh, firing on ship flying. Lemon Sun's colors. Busters even have a, bo a boatload of balls or bugger off for brains. So, you can rest easy, friends. We made it uh, out of cannon range, and no buccaneers bark and will catch this fight, uh, flighty tempest once the winds cut our sails. Nah, nah, nah. That too was me. Nah. Too bled, too, uh, that was too bleeding close. Glad one of us kept his head on the shoulders. I reckon I've lost mine otherwise. If them pirates give us a chase, we might, uh, we must be close to port. 
Let's head up on deck and have us a look, shall we? I don't know if anyone's ever seen like a boat in like real life. And I'm like, I'm talking about like a ship. Those bitches is huge. Oh, uh, boat. Uh, Bo. By the way, is this your first trip to Limsa Lim Liminsa? Uh, yeah. Limsa Limnosa. Lim I'm not gonna say it right yeah, every time I say it. <laughs> it is. Okay. Well then, let's get uh, let this journey into. <laughs> 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 Uh, struggle boss, struggle boss, struggle boss. <laughs> Limsa Lima Pin prides itself on being Erosia's most form, uh, foremost naval power. Erosia. <laughs> if you thought I was saying any of these words correctly, you are wrong. Weren't too long ago that the place was uh, ruled by pirates, but thanks to the current Admiral's civilian influence, the city state could almost pass for a respectable nation. You'd never guess she was once a rum swilling buccaneer herself. <laughs> of course, most folk ain't so quick to change. And with a town full of li uh, liberty loving ruffians, you can imagine how many naysayers or troublemakers she's got to, uh, to deal with. Like them pi uh, pirates who took a fancy to us just now. And if that weren't bad enough, uh, I heard the say. Uh, uh, <laughs> we're raiding the coast just as bold as you, uh, bold as you please. Then the sea will impeachment the locals call fishbacks, cause you did, case you didn't know. Ah, a long last land ho. Behold, Limsa La La, la is uh, in a nation blessed by the ocean's bounty and beloved layman, uh, la goddess of navigation. <laughs> We walk like a goober. <laughs> we walk like our fucking underwear is too high up on our waist. Yup. <laughs> Honestly, all the dragon characters do that, even the females. On a windswept isle in the southwestern corner of the realm. This is the same announced or the narrator in fucking. Uh, Amidst the houses. roiling waves of the Rotano Sea lies the maritime city-state of Limsa Lominsa. I'm not saying you're right. To this haven for bandits and brigands, cutthroats and curs, seekers of both freedom and fortune, comes a lone adventurer. <laughs> I gotta go enjoy a little so many yet some... <laughs> not alone for the hero's arrival has drawn the gaze of the nation's patron deity Lim Lane okay. what realm shaking fate has she described in the churning waters of this mortal's future Ah, he's where we part ways, son. You know how old I am? I can be older than you for all you fucking know. I'm off to, mar to, to the markets to deliver me wares that is onto the high road for me. Top of the money to you, my name's Jack the guy. Here, I want, to, <laughs> I want you to have this. By, uh, by way of thanks for saving me, Arthur. Wow, there's nothing in my hand. Hey, you never did tell me your oh, name, wow. did you? Oh, wow. Bullshit. <laughs> Here's an idea. Become the sort of sto uh, storied personage I can brag about having met, and I'll consider a square. But you don't know my name to brag on me, so, like, how would you... Yeah, I knew this one guy. We were on a ship together. Peril Pretty cool. What was his name? Ah. Uh... May the navigator guide <laughs> yeah. this brave soul on his life's voyage. That's the guy. Till sea swallows all. Chill.
Final Fantasy X slash V. Uh, I think they call it like Lala Lala's or whatever they're they're called. Lala's. Yeah, that fucking race <laughs> makes me crack up laughing. Who yeah. <laughs> like who gave this toddler an axe? Hey, you there? I mean you. This is my district, and I'll take my business to know all the scum that washes up on it. First off. <laughs> first of all, how dare you? First of all, you don't know me. How dare you call me scum? Second of all, you you seem mighty right, br uh, bright and important to just come up and be like, Oh, I don't know you. Ugh. Yeah, an adventurer fresh off the boat, is it? Well, then. Allow one of uh, Lima Bean's finest uh, to set you <laughs> on the right path. Hop to it, lad. I haven't got all day. I wonder if your lens is going to be as busy as mine is. Uh, I guess we'll fucking see, won't we? Well, because uh, not that you need to know this right now, but the... Uh, the market board is very close to the Aether point, so a lot of people just hang out in Limsa. And it's just, if you don't have a good enough computer, your computer just lags going to Limsa. Well, hopefully, that's not the case. Turn character. Yeah, basic controls. Baby's first MMO. It's not my first MMO, this is just the first one I'm more or less getting serious about. <laughs> Oh, I understand. All right. Uh, Non-player characters, NBCs, offer impression of expectations, but the hands break with the limit to do the best. All right, talk to me. We are working as an adventure by the city state and blah blah blah. You okay? Whatever. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah blah blah. Now that I'm sure you're interested to explore, but the adventures are required to register in their presence in the city, and without a bit of local knowledge, you're going to get yourself your throat slit in some piss stinking alley. Do you see? I'm just as big as you are. Ain't nobody fuck with me. <laughs> so, I don't fuck with you. Yeah, <laughs> so before you do anything else, get yourself over to Drowning Wench and enroll in the Adventures Guild. Cool. It's not far. Just head straight down street uh, with... Jafar, that's not his name. Uh, he'll know what happened to work the big moving platform and we'll call Crow's left and that'll take you to the pub. Cool. Once you're there, look for the following uh, look for a fellow by the name of uh, Bateron. He's the proprietor of the flinch. He uh, might curse like a ill sodden sailor, my kind of dude, but then the man's got a soft spot for what I do, colors like yourself. I'll set you straight. Got all that? Good. Get the fuck out of my face. <laughs> Good. Great. <laughs> the duty list. Upon uh, accepting the quest, the current objectives will be in the duty list on the right side of the screen. The maximum amount of five quests can be displayed at once. Uh, like you, clicking on the title will open the quest journal and allow you to re receive objectives and rewards. Okay. Okay, bye! Okay, <laughs> thanks, bye. Excuse me. Welcome to Lima Bean. If your mind visited the drowning lunch, crows like you will take it. Uh, yes. Going up on a Tuesday. Girl in the clutch. Fun fact, I don't like that song. Yes. <laughs> yes, this is a low texture book. Greetings to meet you, lad. This is, in fact, a low texture book. Uh, a little bit. Uh, if you wait here for a. Uh, oh my god, he's, he's so Irish. 
<laughs> You've come to Manjia adventuring, I reckon. We'll find no shortage of work here in Linza. The name is Bederon, and the most opposable of the opposer. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's also awesome. I'm not doing this. Just talk normally. I I'm not doing this. There's gonna this. be a lot of talking. Look, okay, I was gonna do the accent so it would be easier for me to read, but it's not. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> Frankly, my dear, it's not. It's not. Uh, not that they need in, uh, needed in these parts. I mean, counts of the, uh, uh, oh, there being trouble wherever you look. If you manage to steer clear of the fish, uh, fish bits and the not cobalt of outside the city, the pirates on uh, the inside will get you instead. Get you instead. And if the and if they don't manage, there's uh, always a Garmin Empire to finish the job. Uh, no one knows what they're planning, of course. But if they're planning anything, you'd be sure they'll kill a lot of us. This town seems peaceful at a glance, but look again and you'll see people living in fear of what tomorrow might bring. New Glanum, after everything that's uh, appended, uh, Yorza took a mighty blow to the, during the colony, but our uh, well, homes weren't the only things that well, got wiped off the face of the existence by a thrice damned bastard of a dragon. Hey, I'm right here, man. There's two of us right here. Watch your fucking mouth. It took a bleeding memories, too. Uh, no one's been able to explain uh, explain in the way of uh, On's own sense. Okay, I did know about that. So basically, uh, the fucking calamity took away the memory. They just know the fucking calamity happened. Mm -hmm. There is one thing we all remember, though. It's the group of ventures that laid down their lives to drag Eorza back from the brink when she was bound for her abyss. Well, I say remember. Truth is, though, we uh, we ain't forgotten what they did for us. These goddamn calamity spawned memory loss robbed us of their names. It won't even let us picture the damn faces. It's just like starting at a go flying uh, in front of the sun, and yeah, okay, whatever. This is what got people uh, calling the era's warriors a light. If Limbs is ever being put, uh, going to put this time of darkness behind us, going to need adventures to help banish the fear. It's going to need heroes. Uh, like ones we lost. Maybe the, uh, maybe one day you'll be one of them, and that's why you talk a lot. This game is nothing but talking, <laughs> and I it is not an understatement when I say cutscenes are twenty minutes long. Um. I've I've. I've had many, especially when you get into later DLCs, they're like, yeah, make sure you set aside proper time so you can listen and watch this entire cutscene, because it's going to be a while. Uh, so, I mean, I'm used to fucking Metal Gear Solid that has hour and 30 minute cutscenes, I'll be alright. <laughs> it's not quite an hour, but they'll they'll get long they don't so cutscenes the long cutscenes are usually non-voiced the voiced ones aren't as long generally just because well that's just a lot of pain people to voice stuff but like you can make it easier for us let's play it so come on dude. i'm not trying to read everybody voices i gotta give everybody voices we want to read too and shit come on <laughs> Captain being uh, reported by attack, attacked pirate vessel. Oh, I'm gonna be careful because we gonna be here for a while. And several witnesses have testified independently that the passenger matching your description went on the deck mere moments before the incident took place, sending your friends signals. Were you? No. Also, are you the police? You got the wrong bloke. This fine upstanding young gent is me is dear departed grandma's sister's niece's cousin's closest companion. The lad wouldn't be caught dead fraternizing with such unsavory elements. Is that right? You sure uh you surely aware of their recent kidnappings? Respectfully then, we cannot be too trusting of outsiders at a time when the loyalty of our even our closest friends is in doubt. Uh, you make a good port officer, very well, very wise. You needn't worry, though. I keep an eye on him on odd times. Uh, me to the blah. Now, sir, what do you... Say you tinkered the 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 But I wanted a cup of piss like last time, I should hope. Ain't the faintest idea what you're talking about, officer. The wrench might well offer some of the cheapest work on the side of the street of Methyl. But don't mean we ain't getting you good to be picked. And look at the chair over there, just crying out to be sat on. So kicking them off the heavy boots, eh? 
Yo, fuck the police. Have to excuse these eager uh, uh, yellow jackets. They've been uh, spayed, spayed a kidnapping scene. They ain't got a clue what's, who's behind them. Naturally, they've been taking a clap in the irons to anyone who looks vaguely suspicious. They, you said that because I'm. They, they came over here because I'm black. Don't take it personal. They came over here because I'm a black and Bahamut's a dragon. All right, that's what that, that's how it is. <laughs> Welcome to uh, Lima Bean. This is the seas of Green's faces, patrons of the team with the bed. With the... You guys get to really see how terrible my fucking reading skills are. <laughs> yeah. Take any first step as an adventure in the city of Lumbean. Listen to one of the uh, later on thing is for the blood. Da, 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 da. Yay! Okay. Uh, so that's the main story quest right here. Quest of the icon indicate the task. Uh, Sees a test attached to the duties and pushes the deal with Cool. Do the thing. Go. Yeah, so the fancy one is main story, and then everything else is just like optional. Cool. I started you off my to the three tasks that help you get uh, used to life here in uh, Lamenza. No, my be broken. <laughs> Firstly, you down the floor, point your nose at the glass, and you get an eyeful of the great glowing crystal in the middle of the courtyard. Okay, they're gonna tell, they're gonna explain to me about the 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 fast travel thing. Mm-hmm. Very important for Limza. Mm hmm mm hmm And Ulda. The one where uh Naomi started, because for some reason, even though it's my hometown, I don't even remember the name of it right now. Uh easily walkable, you don't really need to uh teleport. If I'm aware correctly, uh it costs resource to do so anyway. Uh, if you're within towns, it doesn't cost any money to teleport, but when you're going from, like, Uldal to Limza, that will cost guild, but you're gonna make so much money, it doesn't even matter. If you run out of money, you're doing something wrong. Okay. <laughs> Sounds like a good right? Man, I never, uh, never know what's interesting, uh, opportunities could be lurking out there, just wasting your, uh, for you to stumble with the, uh, huh, why not let you know some chance to say? Run an errand. That's how you get your name down around here. Uh, Smith, you wrench. Blood's been bad title, so get yourself some cool weapons. Hi. <laughs> Look at this toddler. To leave the dreading once, you must accept the request by making a name by speaking with Ninia. Ninia? Ninia. Uh, okay. Uh, look at this shiny adventure. This is close, lad. I've, uh, some information that might help you put your name in the map here. I've passed through a bulwark hall not too long ago, saw a bunch of people who was just scattering about on the ground. Now, I'm not entirely certain, but I think they might have been black market and stream flowers. Lima Bean's a busy port. Not all, uh, not all merchants that blow uh, across the strait are uh, on board. If you know what I mean, how the plants end up in the. Uh, okay, go get the fucking plants. We're gonna go get the plants. Uh, where we are? Hello. So would you start playing, uh, Final Fantasy fourteen? Probably... Like twenty seventeen. I, I thought you. I thought your ass was about to say twenty years ago. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, twenty seventeen. I think something like that. Cause I played my. Oh no! Wait, it would have been twenty eighteen actually. 
Because I, uh... I did my... free trial because of my cousin. And I played that for a stream, so it had to be... Like, 2018, 2019? Something like that. I did it. Are you proud of me, Dad? Probably go faster. Uh, there is a run button right all the way to the right on your. Uh, action bar is the sprint button that you get for like 30 seconds and then it's like a minute cooldown fun no continuously running forever wait what is happening right now pressing the night time experience bars uh the sanctuary here arrested but it's the place with the team to it's right on all experience earned through battle crafting and gathering while under the benefit of the percent Current master bonus is displayed. Uh, okay, at the bottom there. Um, Dark Orange Bar shows how much more uh, experience can be earned, but the bonus fades. If the bar is blue, it indicates your bonus material to the next level. Inns and cities, as well as various outposts and settlements, are classified as sanctuaries to maximize experience, earning potential, uh, and other shit. Picked up the flowers. I don't. I didn't get any. I, I didn't get any uh, backwards. So you're gonna have to roll that shit yourself. <laughs> Did I go too high. I think I went too high. I must have went too high. All right. Yeah. Yeah. My bad. I told y'all, y'all was gonna find out how terrible my reading skills are. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. Uh, where's that little. There you are. Alright, not used to that. Did I not do the thing? I thought I did the thing. Did you do it right? I thought I did. I picked up the shit. Main menu grants quick access to most of the game's main features. Example, uh, second character on that character opens a window containing various various attributes. Uh, currently equipped deer. Second journey under doodle disposable score and objectives completed on the quest. If you wish to continue the game's various settings, include key, binding, HUD, and blah blah blah. Game progressed and saved automatically, so there is no end game save for load function snake fop. However, to prevent data from being lost or broken, it is strongly recommended that you end each session by uh, selecting a logout or exit game from the system menu. Pressing on your keyboard, select the mini map. M for map, got it. Uh, travel. If your quest objective is located within the area, it will be indicated with the special icon. Uh, objectives can also be confirmed with clues looking at the doodle list. Alright, can I talk to you now? Are we done? Nope. No. Talk forever. Nope, same thing. Literally the same thing. Why be done when you cannot be done? Uh. What is going on? What are we doing? Uh, the little bit peculiar. Great question. Oh, okay. There it is. On the right there. Reading is hard. Where's that? Where's the little. Where? Where? Uh, where? It's 
so many things that I'm looking at. Oh god. Alright. Uh, if you were wondering, I am, in fact, just wandering around. That's Final Fantasy. You're <laughs> playing it correctly. Okay. Just, just letting everybody know. I don't know what I'm doing. I thought I did. I have no idea what's going on. That's how I know when my subscription should be cancelled, where I'm just wandering. I'm not really doing anything. I'm just wandering. <laughs> Oh, okay. That person fucking teleported the fuck out of here. I don't see as deaf anywhere, so what the fuck? You're wondering what I'm doing. Wandering around. How you doing today, folks? Wonderful. <laughs> Damn it. If I fall, will I die? No. There's some areas that where you can't fall off the side, it just prevents you. Aww. Um out in the world there are some ledges that will kill you. And in that case, either you wait for someone nice to res you, or you have to respawn at uh your Aetherite crystal that you've deemed to be your home uh, and that can change at any point so if you're in one of the new DLCs and you don't want to have to come back to Lipsa when you respawn and then have to spend a lot of time and money getting to the next place again you can just do it for the Aetherite crystal in the DLC now I gotta touch that thing yep you're gonna have to go downstairs for that yeah And then once you get all the crystals in the city, you don't have to talk to this guy anymore. You just be like, oh, I gotta go here. All right. Cool. There you are. I found it. I did it, guys. So proud of you. Yes, I'm Astef. You have a surprise you wish to re-examine. Uh, 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 take it, take it. Take the thing. I get you fine. There you go. Uh, okay, I figured it out. I figured it out. I figured it out. Fuck you. I go legal. Uh, Somnus, the substance brute whose fragrance is said to lull the snippers' mind to sleep in death. Forgive me, I cannot resist the jest. Uh, it's lavender. Cool. Some items can be used to grab various effects, such as instant HP restoration. I should be used in uh, more using an item is the simplest you can use an item subgrants. 
Okay, so I assume that's what these bars down here are. Yes. Okay. Watching on Discord is very difficult because it's very blurry for me. Yeah, uh. Welcome to Discord. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to Discord. Uh. Uh, thanks for being with us, Captain Lavender. I've a nugget of information for the user me. You see, I was recently approached by an unkept seafarer, which uh, is not, I admit, particularly unusual for a man of my profession. What was unusual is that he offered a generous sum of guilt to be introduced to any adventurers I might now experience. Sailors are not known to carry such a wealth of coin uh, about their person, especially with the, the ale houses of uh, Lama being so close at hand. Kidnapped and sent up in the these past months. I suggest you take the information and speak to. Glazrail, the guard who stands upon the entrance of the East Hawker's Alley. It never hurts to show spirit and cooperation to the fellows. Alright. Watch as I touch the thing! Touch it real good. Touch it real good! Boom. But is he, is it, did he have a partner or a, a fucking thing that's a watermelon? Possibly. There's a lot of... In, yeah. That's a minion. I have that minion. It's a really cute one. All right. There's also a calamari tentacle that what, has a gun. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I also own that. <laughs> uh, Beta Ron has sent me more than a few of uh, few of your kind this way of late. I am sub. Uh, I, I am sub subliminal. One of the yellow jackets. Has You're a sub. Me. Yes, he is. Uh, is tasked to keep. Look how big he is. He has to be. <laughs> He's also my charge of pro uh, pro providing guidance and abuse of his device. Fear or not, I shall uh, brief. Uh, debrief. I actually know what this does. So. Uh, now you'll be like, oh, that's the medication that is. She's playing Minecraft, though. Do you like Minecraft? I take holes in Minecraft. I don't build, I don't fight, I just dig holes. That wasn't an answer. <laughs> well, it should tell you my state of mind when it gets to Minecraft, because uh, I don't do anything with it. So I like it for about 20 minutes, and then fair. I'm kind of over it. That's fair. I've... Because I... I suck at building, I'm not good at the fighting mechanics in the game, so if I join a server and they're like, yeah, we just need someone to dig a hole, I'm like, I'm, I'm your person, that's me. Mm -hmm. Got you. You want a I hole? I can do that for you. I got you. you. I got three and I, I can, can make more. <laughs> I can dig such good holes for you. Because uh... I've tried hosting my own Minecraft server for stream and... People join it, but they're like, Marv, why are you never on? I'm like, I got bored of it. But you only played for a day. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I dug a hole. Like, <laughs> mission accomplished. Like, what more do you want from me? Yeah, I'm not the uh, biggest fan of Minecraft. Um, it, it, it's just not. Nice. more to it. I'd be inclined to play it more. Like, there's this game called Portal Knights, essentially Minecraft, but better. And I love Portal Knights. I've dumped like 500 hours into it. Fair enough. Um, my thing with Minecraft is that it's for people to like express themselves and be creative and everything like that. I'm an artist. I do that anyway. <laughs> you have no issues with that. You already got that covered. You don't yeah. need assistance. Yeah. Look at all these quests I'm getting and I'm probably not going to complete. That's the great part, is there's so many quests that you can do that when I was playing main story and I only had one job unlocked, or class unlocked, I maxed out my class and I had to go make a new, I had to go spec into a new class so I wouldn't waste all the experience you got on main story because you get an <laughs> insane amount. Might I interest you in the service of a retainer? 
suspicious seafarers on the prowl, gullible adventurers, possible suspect of recent kidnapping. You think? Well, I'm sure to pass the word on the customers. Uh. Okay. Pretty sure nobody really wants to this. Yep, done. I did it. Proud of you, yeah, Marv. I'm so proud of you. got an ad for a marshmallow coke. <laughs> that sounds gross. <laughs> that, that didn't Someone sound very it. appetizing. I must grateful to have it back to if this tool seems to keep the blood and say to uh, have whatever. It's simply in surgery of veteran equipment seeming to look no further than the east of the west side of the hall. Thus, you got Lest you doubt, each guild gives uh, guild you invested arms and armor with the money well spent. A veteran is after all the most dangerous profession in the trip. F fizzy puppy sounds fun. Uh, I'll let you have that. I disagree, <laughs> but I'll let you have that. Uh, You're entitled to your wrong opinion. That's fine. <laughs> uh, fish and lobster serve you well in the uh, if your purse is light and your time is short. I bet you explore the markets yourself. You have a quest for me, sir? Oh, man. I'm probably going to, uh... Use a controller eventually because I cannot lean forward for this amount of time. My back fucking hurts. <laughs> wow, this I... is tanky as fuck. Yep. <laughs> I do know one person that does Final Fantasy on the computer but uses a controller. I always thought it was weird. Um. Yeah, in my current setup, in I I have to uh, lean forward. And I don't have a problem doing it for like the first like 20 minutes. Anything after that, my back starts to hurt. Mm -hmm. Although, I'm, if I'm not... If I'm not mistaken, um, I think it's easier if you're on PC to uh, play it with like mouse and keyboard. Mm -hmm. um, because you have more slots. Between, or it's easier to get to your slots rather. Right. Uh, trade. Sweet. That's why. This is why I make money. This is why I spend money. <laughs> you can make money anywhere. Depends on how you want to make the money. Can I be a hoe? Yes, you can. A hundred percent. I was kidding. Can you actually? <laughs> yeah, no, uh, that's one of the RP things you can do. It gets really sketch. Uh, would not recommend doing that, but you can be a hoe. Wow. You can be a Final Fantasy hoe. People get really obsessive and stalkerish in this game, so, uh... That's why I don't recommend it, but to each their own. Well, I can't imagine too many people want me. I don't know what your next sentence is going to be, but someone wants it. 100%. <laughs> All right. There is a market for everything in this game. Fair enough. And because the mod community exists, everything is possible. Fair enough. I've seen mods that make people pregnant or have the biggest of boobs so yeah so, some some people need that like naomi was like doing customizing her character and she has mentioned before that she has she's well endowed and uh the biggest size in in this game is not that big yeah no they don't do very big boobs in this game so people modded it so that you can i do that but as, mm, actually, you shouldn't talk about mods, but whatever. Talk about the mods. We don't care here. I don't give a fuck. 
<laughs> you were, well, if you want to talk about anything and any everything, you were in the right area. Well, the problem with mods is that uh, the people, uh, Final Fantasy specifically, they find out that you are using mods. It's generally a bad thing because a lot of people do it for very bad things, like pedophilia. Yes. Um, especially with the Lala's, it makes it stupid easy. Okay. Uh, so, I was that's not why reading being what a that said. Game. I, had to, I was not, for anyone who was wondering, I was not reading what that said. I was just clicking that. Uh, that that <laughs> has to be a joy to kill. <laughs> um, I don't care anymore. Just keep going through the story. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I'm going to hit you with the straight yikes. Yeah. Uh, they found one person. There's there's this kid later down the road. She's got a very sad backstory, and this person made a mod to where he would have the the doings with her, and posted it online, and they found out. And uh, his account is like perma banned. You cannot get that account back. Uh, well, I'm. That sounds like it should be though. Like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't. I don't think anyone was complaining about complaining about that. Yeah, so mods can be a little sketch at times, but <laughs> looking through the mod website is amazing. <laughs> See so much funny shit. I just want dreadlocks. Uh, there's probably a really nice hair mod for dreadlocks. I mean, there is the haircut in the game, but apparently that's only for women, which doesn't make sense. But whatever. Apparently, you're not black, unless you're female. Well, it might also be, like, for males, it might be under a different race, because each race has their own hairstyle. So, like, some of the hairstyles for Ah Ra's, you can't get them on the other uh, races. So, maybe for the Rose, huh. there is a dreadlock style for the male, but it's only for Rose kind of thing. Anyway, I have to go eat dinner, so if you need me, I'll come back. I mean, yeah. I mean, I'll be here. If the the call is open, so just jump in if you if you just bored. <laughs> I don't care. Oh, Alright. Bye. Thanks for being here. All right. Uh, now would probably be a grand opportunity for me to try my controller up because my fucking back hurts. So. No, not in the chat mod settings. Alright, okay. Hmm. And maybe this. We'll figure it out. Probably. Maybe not. Who knows? set it up. Make it all my money. How do I get to my set it?
gonna we'll play like this for a while, and then I'll figure it out later. So, uh, yeah, normally I don't, uh, I'm not the biggest fan of, uh, MMOs. Mostly because the stuff that we're doing right now, this bores me to tears. But, maybe playing in the future will help me out. They're playing with friends, rather. I want to get down there, over there. I see, I see, I see," said the blind man. Game is pretty, though. What is homie over there doing? You wanna see that shit? Wait, I died. Anyway. Really, not the winner of the fisherman's industry sales. Fish focus started to attract the season tomorrow. Yeah, but I've never really played MMOs before. Not fully, I guess. Where's he trying to get me to go? Anyway, I guess you gotta go take that one. I got my tickets all the wrong way around.
They are really close together. He delivered the package as requested. Yep. Mm -hmm. One man at the service is five. You're lucky five pounds soon enough? Oh, good. Oh, thank you. I did. Alright, what else we got here? Turn yourselves to the thing in the lower decks, which is over here. Where's the Marauder's Guild? Where's the Marauder's Guild, though? Anarchist Guild, Fisherman's Guild. Fuck is this? Oh, able to execute the command. I don't really know what the red shit does either. Where am I? Alright, that lady just died in front of us then. It's probably a good thing. Probably a good thing that Marv left. Because now I gotta figure shit out on my own instead of being told, which is good. Because I'm fucking stupid otherwise. Alright. Check a book key. Alright. Alright, the second kick. So I know where I am. Go over there. Cool. All right. Oh boy, that's not what I wanted. Okay. All right then. I go the wrong way. Maybe I can. Looks like I can. Alright. 
this side quest over here, but I'm gonna ignore it. Let's speak to Letitia. Tax evaders among our pa uh, patrons, you say. Goodness me. There you go. Take that. Took eight years, but we got there. Talk to you then. Yes, I'm uh, Warren Zowin, Axe Master, they call me. Not the most even imaginative titles, I uh, agree, but uh, one should not underestimate the value of directness. I welcome you to the interest of our guild. The art of Marauder is used to run, to cleave, and to destroy. It is not our way simply to outfight our adversaries, but we seek to overwhelm them. Marauder must be the most powerful and enduring presence on the battlefield. We must account for the most enemies defeated. Our role in combat is uh, that of Steel World when defeating death and destruction without equal. No doubt the question has already been uh, put to you by uh, Blautha, but once more I challenge you to commitment. Are you ready for the bloody carnage? Yes. Very well. Your name? Attend me then. Uh... Too much of a thing? I thought I did. Yeah, no, I did. Just looking around, making sure I'm not missing anything. Okay, okay, cool, whatever. I was running through the six with my wolves. You know where that shit go. I was running through the six with my wolves. Where is that? Is that down there? No, where is this? Aha! 
Hello, my friend. Alright. There you are, Mugen. Enjoy your jaunt around the city you did. That will be the last time I've been three places, but now you've got some idea what's exploring the rest of the town. I uh, should have shown a good ear for listening. I stick with the old bear having you go far. Cool. I leveled up, yay! second. Aha! There we go. Alright, now that we've got that, give me one second. Ah, shall be right back. back and I got some uh, chill, chill vibes in the background courtesy of the homie no need for topics uh, I'll try to remember to put hit the link to his stuff in the description up below um, I don't think I did last time and uh, I need to so now that we've got this all set all up I need to mess around with my other controls what are we doing Um, I need to go back over here. Oh, uh, I didn't realize if I moved, but I interrupted that. Access to move the map now that I've attuned myself to everything. Now I need to go slay some. Okay, now I did choose something. 
No, I understand. I'm starting to get ahead of things, I think. Right. So I gotta go all the way over here. with the raid. How are you doing today? How was your editing? I'm uh, currently being lost in the world of Final Fantasy XIV and I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Slim, how are you doing? Have any of you guys played this game?
by adding and choosing collecting more viewers than I thought. I mean, if I wasn't doing my own strip, I'd be there too. But, I mean, people like hang hanging out. People like chilling. I've never played a single Final Fantasy ever. Um, I haven't played any of the good Final Fantasies, according to what uh, hardcore Final Fantasy players tell me, but uh, I enjoyed uh, the ones that I have played. How do I get down here? Yeah, but you people were just chilling. What were you guys talking about? What were you all on about? Yeah? If you hang on long enough, you might skip to see me do some voice acting. This is not the correct way. Our character doesn't talk, but, uh,. I gotta look at my PC so uh, that it renders the videos. I mean, without any lag caused by me, fair enough. No, he wasn't kidding. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I <laughs> when when cutting like jokes, you could tell very much when he's joking. He was not. He was not kidding. He had never played. I have no idea how to get down. I know where I'm supposed to go. I don't know how to get there. Maybe I gotta talk to the elevator dude? Yeah, I think I gotta talk to the elevator dude. I do plan on playing every Final Fantasy game in order of release though. I feel like most people would tell you to skip one. That's up to you, of course, but... Um, yeah, I'm playing music courtesy of the homie No Need uh, for Topics. He might show up in your streams uh, a couple of times. I believe this, the song I'm playing right now is uh, Naomi's favorite. How oh, I attack? Uh, the Fate System. Fate is short for Full Active Time Event. Public event. The public uh, quests occur periodically in real time across Earth. Rosa. Yours, yeah. Uh, anyone can participate in simple form uh, before it ends. When you sense a fate nearby, a message will appear on the screen and the location will be split on your map. The type of fate is uh, in progress can be identified by its own map icon. Now, as you go the icon, will display the fate type. You'll automatically join a fate the moment you cross into the event threshold. At this time, the fate uh, time of uh, title objective, objectives and time remaining fully on your duty list. If you're several, if you are several levels higher than the, oh my god, what the fuck? Did y'all see that? What the fuck? They all told me to skip one and a few others. I'm going to ignore that advice. Oh, all right, well, <laughs> there you go. Yeah, as far as I'm aware, one is just literally only turn-based combat. Um, your sub levels are higher above or right the level, but uh, level suit button will appear to your duty list. Press the button automatically and lower your level so that you can participate in the event before. Okay, that's cool. Battle. I don't know how to select that. There we go, that's my stuff. Right click on the target. I'm not using fucking uh, active mode into ready auto attack. Uh, approach the target. There is actually such a spell, spoken skills, and right click that I cut. It's on the hot bar. On the bottom of your screen, it's actually doing so much. MP, I know how it works. There's just hooks, it's just archers at this super high target distance. Achievements are on by reaching a certain map class. Do you hit yours the adventures? The achievements are just for everything from reaching low classes that adopt uh you know. There are also rewards for obtaining certain achievements. Some of these include rare weapons, armor, and the titles such as this. Cool, whatever. How?
Oh, we auto attack. Okay, I get it. I understand. Okay. How I do this on controller is a bit odd. Though. So I was I was using keyboard and mouse up until just now because uh, I have to lean forward in order to use keyboard and mouse and my back hurts. So uh, in the event of multiple solo players attack the same target, the, the player who attacks first will always receive 100% of the experience points that I just drop. That's probably a fair way to do that. Uh, the players who follow will, will be rewarded based on their contribution to the battle. If you see a fellow player in need of hand, do not hesitate to lend yours. An item you have equipped to you now is bound and you can no longer be traded out traded or put up for sale in markets most items can be sold and traded freely uh, before they use the battle crafting and gathering this is true regardless of whether they are not been equipped however performing one of these three actions uh performing the put new piece of gear will bind to you preventing future trade or sale uh, to npcs huh Okay, but how do I use my hotbar there? A second term is combat by Endure the Mother series. Uh, the Mother series is very lenient with its rolling health bar. Which reminds me, I should probably get a chair with a back to sit on. Landy! You telling me that you've been playing with us this whole entire time in a fucking stool? Or the equivalent of a stool? Is that what you're telling me? some lands. Little lick bug. More plants. I'm gonna be real with you guys. Playing on keyboard was easier. If I had a setup that made that feel better, I would totally do that instead. What in the shit? This is how I. This is all my shit that I can learn as a, a thing. I'm currently level three. Cool. Uh, there's some lines. Take that, Vincent. I haven't gone 
gun one right in front of the uh, dining room table, and I feel like it would be a little block the wall, but you could just move it out the way later, could not you? Melee-oriented classes such as Gladiator and Marauder can chain together their weapon skills to deal damage or inflict additional enfeeblements to their target. This is known as a combo. Combos are not available to the futurists as this melee class employs a unique weapon, uh, weapon skill chaining system. A weapon skill can be chained with another, and it, it will be indicated uh, if the weapon skills help text in their combo action. In the case of Vocal Thrust, uh, they executed immediately after the True Thrust. Some weapon skills can be delivered from a specific direction to maximize their damage. When a weapon skill can be chained into a combo, its hotbar icon will be outlined with the flashing yellow border. The border will fade into the weapon skill uh, if the weapon skill is not used within a certain amount of time. When weapon skill chains together, you maximize the damage. So. Let me try, let me try this with mouse and keyboard for a second. Alright, this is significantly easier. This is significantly easier on mouse and keyboard because you literally just click the thing. I don't understand how to do this on the controller. I'm googling shit. I don't. I don't understand how this is, how this works. So. Do I have to like set it up? Is that what's going on here? Place allows you to share information. Okay, so this is uh, yeah, that's not what I'm Keep gamepad enabled by activity, vibration, and 
sucks, that's the Name sucks. I did my name. I literally don't know what's going on. Since the armory system in Final Fantasy XIV allows you to change your class or job by simply changing the weapon or tool in your main hand, it is recommended that you always have several sets of gear in hand. However, gear can take up a tremendous amount of space in one's inventory, which is why all adventurers carry an armor chest. All gear purchase crap that you found in is automatically stored in the chest, leaving your, leaving your inventory free to fill with one with other items such as potions, crafting materials, and food. Here in your army chest categorized by a sorted type and could be equipped with discarded directly from the chest in the The army chest can be accessed at any time with selecting characters from the main menu followed by armor chest control. But you keep giving me the fucking You keep giving me the controls for don't understand none of you have played this game and let me know what the fuck's going on i don't get it i don't understand how to use the hot bar on controller
What? Got it. I think, maybe. Perhaps I got it. I'm not sure. Maybe I don't have it. Jesus Christ. Uh, Marv, if you're here, I would love your help. Change step one, don't do that. The reason being, 
I'll explain this. So, for example, I'm on a... Uh... I know I said... Marv, I need, uh, I need, I need assistance. Actually, before I even ask you, do what, do you play on keyboard or you play on controller, right? Because I have no idea, I'm, I switched the controller and I have everything basically picked it up. I have no idea how to use the hard button. Now, for fucking in the game, I could just hit one or two or whatever, right? But uh, for controller, I don't know how to do that. Like, I figured out how to attack. Figured out how to do everything except use the damn hop -up. I feel like it shouldn't be that damn hard. I'm trying to try bumpers and triggers. I have. Stop. Thank you. And every time I look up something for it, it always gives me the fucking PC version of shit. And I don't need the PC version of shit. This is the closest I've gotten to this, and I don't know what...
Oh no, one second. Marv sent me a bill. Literally just pressing the thing is not doing enough for me. I don't understand.
Ah, goodness. First, make sure you have the crossbar enabled by going to character config, on bar settings, and crop. There we go. It wasn't turned on. There we go. I got it now. All right. It wasn't. It literally wasn't turned on. So let's try this again. There we go. At least I got that figured out. I gotta figure it out. I'm not sure how to use multiple high fives, but we gotta we gotta see. Okay, no, actually I think I think I do have to figure it out. Alright, Jesus Christ. That took way too long.
cool. Jesus Christ, we did it. <laughs> it only took 20 minutes, but we did it. Uh, already faced your shows over harder cast, a realization of slaughter, which you were capable of. One year less than swell, but your strength. Yeah. Okay, how to belong as a record of completed tasks involving slaying certain creatures by completing these tasks. You will earn a rewards on, uh, and unlock the challenge. The luck can be accessed via the logs and yeah. So that's the beast here, basically. As long as open, the class of difficulty will be available for challenges of that rank. Challenges marked by uh, name and numbers, uh, such as Lancer 01. Below the na uh, name and number, you will find the target, as well as how many uh, targets you must defeat. Hovering over the target will display the areas. Okay. Okay. Okay, training. Let's go. What is armor is here? I'm starting to get the hang of this, I think I get it. More. Alright, now we're cooking with fucking gas. Where we came from. Fun. Nope, oh, I'm going the wrong way. It's over here. You guys also get to know my know my incredible lack of uh, direction. <laughs> speak with the other dude that's upstairs I think Side. Got it. All right, cool.
All right. Now that we're now that we're getting moving, how you guys feeling? You guys, all right? Uh, our rocks are yet to build a sweat. Don't worry, that defense just get them good, solid, heavy sweat. I gotta break some rocks. Windows to a solid rocks. More, gotta do it again. I don't see any damn solid rocks over here. There they are. Now we gotta go back. Again, shout out to the homie No Need for uh, using his music. Uh, software. Where is that? Is he downstairs? Where is that asshole? Must be downstairs. Has me escort his fledging marauders onto the dangerous task. I suppose what? Uh, yep. Uh, trust you find your own way. Just don't your axe. Investigate the megalogram.
need to go down this way. Um... in the wrong areas, which is fine, because the thing's right here. Playboy Bunny Rats. Alright, I'm not gonna lie. Playing my own custom music, watching these fireworks, it's kind of fun. I'm not gonna lie. This. I'm not gonna lie. That. That's kind of, look at that. That's kind of fun.
go to the fence instead now. Uh, once the page is completed, a window de uh, detailing your reward will be displayed. Rewards are distributed to all event participants that are based uh, in our base, not only on success, but individual contributions. The more active you are in completing an event, the greater your contribution will be deemed. Contribution is indicated by via gold, silver, or bronze metal that allows you to uh, see you in a window. Anyway, let's go do the actual story. It literally says it right there in big fuck you levels. Uh, fuck you writing. Level 5. It also says the down there. So, maybe if I was... You know, good. Uh... I don't know, how do I get up there? Can I get up there? Shit has been investigated. Looks as if nobody's home. May have we knew where we're coming? This person needs help. Hello, old man. Please, it's my grandson. The snippers, snippers, it's goddamn it. Don't the bear. All right, well, looks like we're gonna go fight a thing. away from me, you bloody bastard. Alright, come on. Alright, come on. Bring that ass, then. I ain't scared of you. I ain't afraid of no crab. I'm a cancer, bitch. Is that it? Okay, no, they're the aggro. The aggro.
mean you can't see the friendly? It's right here. Then for sure. I can't play outside no more with all these scary monsters about. Me and me ma and me dad both got kids to the bab. Yeah, I'll, I'll make everything safe for you, kid. That's cool. All right. Hey, bro, I finished. Uh, well done. Counts features of blah. All right, and the boy spirits were the two mini minions. He went into the last part of revenge, and he was real strong. Why can't I accept the the thing? All right. Now I have an actual in-game question that you might be able to answer, Marv. Why can't I complete this? Like, it's forcing me to decline, and I don't understand why. It's nothing to do with this stuff. That's why is it forcing me to the front? Okay, why is it not, let, not letting me accept this the the rewards for this? Oh, it is letting me accept the rewards. I just have to specifically pick which one. I understand.
Uh. All right. I wanted berserk. All right. Now that I understand that, let's go finish this one. I understand that. I was not understanding. Again, don't know what the fuck to do. Like, what now? What do I do? I've completed all my missions. Be level 10 to do this. Alright, and I'm level 6. So, is the only thing I can do right now is, uh... I mean, the only thing we can do right now is, uh... I've actually done some of these already. Shout out to the homie Amy.
here. This is as much as I thought it would, but this is still a bunch of busy. System teleport to go to the main bay. Unlike other spells, teleport is not a requirement of every path, and instead it needs to take natural regenerating spiritual energy. A small fee of gill, however, must be paid to, uh, to the keepers of the uh, Aetherite so that they may, can maintain the crystals and defend them against those who would see them destroyed. The fee varies depending on travel distance to the mountains of the Aetherite equation. Registering an Aetherite as a favored designation will reduce the amount of gill required to travel there, up to three favored designations. So basically, like I set them as my favorites, it may cost less money to do. Not you. Am I right about this? Is there on the inside? Nope. Why don't you swag the fuck out? Say, uh, increases my damage. Get it, Nord. You must be the adventure beta run, blah, 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 blah. Your honor is bored and just blah, 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 over there. Ha, ha. A good number of the lads, lasses. Working here once terrorized the high seas, and you can wonder why I employed the scrags while they used to make a river pirate ship. But the calamity did our, our, but the calamity did for our ship like they did for many others, and I was sore uh, wounded into the burn. I had to be myself and Chris somehow, the Emerald Merrill Webb's uh, initiative 
to get his landlocked uh, Buccaneers work the field seem too far in an offensive at least. Well, as it turns out, you can uh, take the pirate at the sea, but you can't get the sea away from the pirate. A lot of my blokes uh, just never ten took ten into the soil, see, you see. And unfortunately, the botanists I, cl uh, I called in Trainum have been wringing their heads in black despair with so much work calling up. I need tougher soul like you to step in and help where is needed. Alright. Now level set. Eyes. Who's in crit got a creature? Shit is that? Does this tell me how much experience I need for my next level up? No. Nairu, how are you doing today, my friend? How was your stream? Amon! Right now, I'm trying to figure out where the fuck this quest is so I can finish it. Infinite Drogo. I forgot you were something. I can't fight, figure out what this goddamn sub is. Or this sub. Uh, this goddamn. What you call this?
How you doing? I'm getting hungry, but I don't think I'm gonna eat anytime soon. Ah, I see. I understand what's going on. In the game? Uh, uh, I'm not that far ahead. I had some trouble trying to figure out what was going on. Oops. Uh, I tried to figure out what was going on with uh, the control system because I switched from keyboard to uh, to uh, controller. Game life over real life, honestly. Um, but other than that, I'm figuring things out and going, I hate this a lot less than I thought I would, so. Uh, new recruits the Barracuda sent me is worse than the last. I've already had to send three home because they wouldn't stop crying. If only had more men like you with sharp blades, then what's the match? Um, how about you show these yellow uh, bellied green backs to shoot? But sure, whatever. Now that you're here, you can tell me the difference between stay attack and attack. What does that even mean? Good love, love playing with you. I would appreciate that, man, because I'm confused. <laughs> you don't have to, of course, but I'd appreciate that. Yeah, that is bullshit that you can't just hop in. Are we done? Thank you. What was I even doing? Grab some food and make what bad. Uh, I also need to make you, if we're gonna be on call, which I assume we will be, need to make you a PNG as well. I probably should be fighting these things, but I don't care. I'm starting to get hungry again. Um, uh, let me stand right here. My snacks are like two seconds away. Give me one second.
Yes. Ah! I stepped in the fucking mountain. For anyone who doesn't know what's going on when I do that, it's uh, there's a st there's a sticky trap, and I keep stepping. Just keep following the main quest. I don't know what the fuck the main quest is anymore. Oh, I need to slice some of this. We're gonna be here for a little while, so. I got a 10 wind streak in multi blood top lumina. My, my self esteem might get too high. Don't worry, you'll find someone who might hope take you down a peg. There's always someone better. Circus work though. Oh, it does tell me how much experience I need to the next level. It's at the bottom. I'm just I'm just blind. Hey, if uh, by this point you know what's going on in your Avod Watcher and you, you're just screaming at your fucking whatever you're watching this on, phone, TV, 
computer and you're like, why haven't you done this yet? You feel free to join me live on Twitch and uh, tell me why I'm stupid. Link is always in the description down below. I know I'm not great, but I still feel like I'm starting to get it. That's how I felt uh, like an hour ago when I was playing this. I'm gonna take out one of those things. That's stronger than I am. You are ugly now. this uh you have learned a roll action roll actions are spells and weapon skills that are assigned to all classes within a role take melee dps range dps healer rather than a specific class roll actions are uh, learned in the same manner of class actions via leveling but only need to be learned once and uh, to be able to use within, within a simple system. what I learned that the same implement our class actions for your level one, but only need to be learned once to be able to use them all with all participant classes within a role. The role section has been added to actions and traits about another character. Explain the world, thank you, because I don't get it. Like, it explained it to me, and I still don't understand what it means. But, uh, we were just killing time, so I could do this. do the one thing that I wanted to do. Yeah, bud. Let's see here. Fire shot. That's unsellable. 
pero nada ah, más I can set up my I think my only objective currently right now is to get to level 10 so I can continue my Marauder training. So... But actually, a bunch of side quests right here, so I'm not sure what I'm Again, shout out to the homie Noni for his music. to venture inside the missing member you best member uh remember to pay your proper respects to the cap unless you ain't afraid of going missing kneeling that four would be a good start uh words and words aren't just enough i can use them once. i just did one on accident ain't i hot bars for boats that's fine Neil before Rosam? Where is he? In here? Now, normally I'd tell this bitch to kick rocks, but, uh, you know, it's fun, so. Is that not, was that not good enough for you? Okay, there it is. Um, you know, you still have to be disappointed to see how far we've fallen. Alright, I did it. Moving on. Okay, so disappointed. That's funny. Let me just clip through you right quick. Rallied? They really want you to do these fucking emotes, huh? Try to do that squat that they're doing over there. That shit is a. Uh... I was. I'm not built for that kind of squat. Oh, a cactuar.
Or slay some wolf rats? Easy. Let's go. Trying to make sure we're just still playing, uh, no need for music. You know, just making sure. And what do you want? Down and all in there. I was about to say, how do I get down there? Yes. You take the stairs, dumbass. Big chillin' over here, big boy. What the fuck? Wait. Oh, okay. I was like, what the hell? They were being hidden by you. Mm-hmm. 
Wait, where am I going? Oh, okay. Yeah, I was like, wait, wait, where am I going? I need to talk to you. Cool. There you go. Thank you. Bye. Wait, you have a question for me, too? Key items can be uh, the fucking key items. Everyone, everyone just played RPG with the fucking key items. Hello? What is this? I don't know what this is. Anyway. It is. I'm glad I checked. All right. I'm glad I checked because that shit was uh not in music. I'm actually still going the wrong way. It's fine. Gotta get to the other shit. But where is it though?
<laughs> I have an eye patch. I didn't realize I did. There it is. Or maybe it's not there. Maybe I just imagined something. There it is. You got mail. What are we doing? Oh. Alright, cool. Lean God, Naru Lean God.
trying to get my hood to look like the one of the EU server. Also, it seems that I have a character in North America on the Siren server, so I'm going to the US now. Alright, bet. Character is the first character I ever created in the game. Ooh, even better. Right, cool. Closer to level eight. Level 8 should have been the first 15 minutes in the game. In my defense, I spent a good amount of time trying to figure out how the, uh, trying to figure out how to, to switch the controls between keyboard, uh, keyboard and more mouse and, uh, controller. So now I need one more level in order to continue the main story, I think.
Uh, what is your main story for us to call? What do you mean? Yeah, I mean, dress to call is a good thing. Hi, right, Crusher, how you doing? The one that I'm currently doing is dress to call, yeah. But what, if you're asking me what it is, uh, I don't fucking know. Let me have over that fence, but whatever. Wait, what are you waiting? What are we waiting for? I haven't left anywhere.
Press H. Why are we looking at the hunting log? Gives me tons of XP? Bad. I saw a couple of those when I was just running around. Faster than doing a random quest. Bet. Speaking of a B cloud, there's one right there. Check these uh, hunt monsters uh, are by hovering over your cursor of uh, the hunting log. Yes, yeah, that's what they are. Cool. There's another one. I was say, it's weird that it didn't hang on me. Uh, Nairi, if you want to get on call, you can, bro. Just let me know. It'd probably be easier than typing it for three seconds. Can't speak that loud? That's no problem. Your mic is kind of loud anyway, so I'll, I'll probably have to turn you down.
You good over there, Minaru? You can't see me. Why can't I see you? You know where I don't know what you look like, right? So maybe I just literally didn't see you. There you are. I look like an idiot. <laughs> How you doing tonight, man? I'm sad, man. I can only play for like one more hour and then I need to go to bed. Yeah, you got work, right? Yeah. So sad. So. You want ladybugs, huh? Well, I just got, I think I just got that. I'm doing this fake real quick. Dude, I'm level 20. I didn't even know. <laughs> this is gonna be light work for you, man. One hit, uh -huh. one hit kills over here. Uh, well, not really. Not in fate, because I need to be level synced. Ah. Because okay. I could be level 80, but I, it will level sync me down. Right, right, I did say that. Doing fates is also good for leveling up, I guess. It, it was the, the major source of experience back in the day. In the good old days, before the main story quest gave you a ridiculous amount of experience. Making every single quest that you do completely pointless. Yeah, I think I need to be level 10 in order to continue the story, because it makes me, it's making me do the, uh, the rest of the Marauder stuff. Oh, no, 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 okay. The, the Marauder quest... If you don't need to be level 10, it's just, I think it's just telling you that the next Marauder quest will be at level 10. But you don't need to do this to continue the Marauder quest. Like, I don't know if I'm making myself clear. It's like, you should continue the main story quest, which if you look at your left up, upside, there's like a little thing, right, that says... What does it say? Or now it's just lurkers in, the, lurkers in the grotto, apparently. Okay, click that. And where, where does it take you? Uh, Summer Four Farms. Okay, then go to Summer Four Summer far, far Farms. Summer Four Farms. Yeah, I didn't yeah. say it right either. And keep doing that story, because that's all you should need to do, since you're a new player. And I think this is a new server, I think, so... Right, well, Maybe there's there's even experience boost. It, it wasn't really that clear when I was doing it because normally the the quests for story stuff are like green, and um, those aren't. The the main story quest is like a, a little quest symbol, like the ones you have, right? Yeah. But instead of being a in a, a circular pattern, it's like flames. There's a. It, it, I can't really explain better than that. It's it's a flame, a flaming quest sign. Just say it like that. So after you deliver those quests, let's go to Summer Something Farm. Yeah. Uh... Oh, I see it. It's, it's up there. I see. Where am I going? What? How? What am I doing? I'm not sure. Right here. How about this? I'll invite you to a party, and I'll teleport you to where you need to go. Okay. I think. Can I can I do that? Enable to teleport. You are not attuned to that athrite. Okay, I'm not attuned to that athrite. I need to go touch it. 
<laughs> I'm going. Uh, I think I oh, and by the way, I think so. Yeah, if you already touched it. Yeah. Uh, the best way to teleport, uh, at least to me, because I'm on the PC, I'm not using the controller, is to just open the map and then you just click on the crystal. Oh, I didn't realize you could do that. Yeah. <laughs> what? I didn't get the teleport prompt, goddamn. Oh, yeah, it's because I'm not. Okay. okay. I'm, I'm going. Okay. <laughs> I'll meet you there. Alright. See, this is why having an experienced player is helpful, because I would have been kept doing the fucking Marauder shit. Yeah. I need to. Yeah, it, it's a bit confusing. At the beginning. Alright, so I just need to keep doing the quest here. Uh, yeah, f find the, the quest with the flame, the flame sign. Ah, there has to be. Yeah, mm -hmm. I see it. No, 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 no. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah never mind. I, I said no, but yeah, I forgot that the, the stream is a little bit behind. Yeah. Yeah, but that that's it. As long as you follow those quests, those flaming quests, you will have everything that you need, and you will level up super fast. I I think you will finish the the main story, like the the initial main story, like even beyond the max level. Really? Yeah. Because back in the day we would finish the main story at level fifty, but now you will reach like level fifty-five or something. Yeah, I think the max level and right now is sixty. Before I have to yeah, for you. Anyone, at least. Yeah, because you have the, the, the trial, right? Yeah. <laughs> trial. It's not I, really I like a trial. It. It's like a fucking... It's a whole ass game. Yeah, th this trial is basically 40 hours of gameplay. If you do everything that you that you can do. Or more. <laughs> yeah, maybe even more. Uh, Depends you on how good you got. You want me to stay here because you haven't touched the, uh, the thing? Uh, no, no, no. Go, go do your thing. Okay, cool. Uh, I'll be, I'll be following. I'm, I'm level twenty. All uh, right, yeah. I, I need guess. to, re re I need to remember uh, what so I need there to. There you do. are. <laughs> hey. Oh my God, my, my hood is all over the place. Okay, here we go. Middle of the shit. Say. Maybe if we're fast enough, we'll even go do a dungeon together. Ooh. I'll be a DPS. And you'll be the tank. I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to let you, like, go. <laughs> oh, how about the story? Are you reading the story? Uh, for the side quests, I'm not. But other than that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. F fuck the side quests. Some of them are good, but most of them are just like, alright. It, it's like your filler anime episode. What are you trying to get me to do? Let's see. What the fuck? Why is your stream at 480p? What? What? I was watching your stream at 480p <laughs> and I was like, I can't read shit. Investigate the seasoning grotto. Oh, I know where you need to go. I'll take you there. It, it's a place underground. Oh, okay. That's what I'm like. I'm sitting on top of it. I don't understand what's going on. Yeah. Oh, uh, if you look at your minimap, you will see the the symbol of the quest, right? Yeah. And if you will notice that there's like a little arrow on the side of the quest, marking mm -hmm. down an arrow down. That's when you know that if you have to go down or if you have to go up. Ah, I got you. Just so like they explained so much and none of it was that. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, you know that's because it, they don't explain that because that's something that they added later, much, much later. I, I think it was only in the the third expansion that they added that because it was when they introduced flying, and because of the flying, there was a lot of verticality to the game. So people were getting lost like they were on top of quests and then had no idea where the quests were so they added that for people to know if it was down if they needed to fly up or fly down uh, I I down but... oh if you look at your map you'll actually see a like a, a place that it seems that has a, a different height a different altitude let me see if I can get there yeah here it is 
You can also see where I am on the map. Yeah, you're the blue. Come, come here. Yeah. Uh, come here. Yeah. This is the place. Okay. So and I think we'll have to leave. We'll have to leave the party because this was going to be like a, a mini boss thingy. Uh, to see if you learn how to play the game. Well, now it doesn't matter. Back in the day, it would matter. Sometimes these little mini bosses could kill you. But now it, the game really will not kill you at all. I think the game will only start to be hard outside of raids, of course, in the new expansion. Gotcha. But now I think the only thing that can kill you are dungeons. I think. Not sure. Stance battle and stance battles occur during certain quest missions. Take a moment to read the information display and react to when it comes from the Call of Duty. Yeah, it's a story segment. Okay, I'm already going to so we're good. Yeah, say proceed, just to see if you can go with me in the party. Yeah, you can, okay. And I'll leave and I'll wait for you here. Okay. Good. Have fun. I shall. I am the waves that bear. Is that what you are? I am the winds that guide. I am the evening stars. I am the morning sky. I am born of the sea. And there shall I die. Hey man, that's my wife. <laughs> oh yes, her, I remember the sailor's her. Sure requiem carved into yonder stone. Yeah. Dude, with every expansion, well she gets the sexier and sexier. In which the <laughs> citizens of Limsa, Luminsa live their lives. It is both a litany against misfortune for those out on the waves, and a prayer that the souls of those who perish on land might find their way back to the sea. Ah, you are the adventurer I've seen around Summerford Farms. Yeah. I thought myself on the trail of the kidnappers, but it would seem I have missed my mark. Oh. Or perhaps not. As I suspected, the etheric disturbance here is no natural occurrence. Nor is it a coincidence that the two of us should come here in search of those responsible for the disappearances, only to be attacked. But who stands to benefit from the keeping of this secret? Oh, such thoughts must wait. Let us attend to the task at hand, unpleasant though it be. I like her. Oh, and, and by the way, all the voice actors change in the Heaven's Ward for much better actors. So, if you don't like, if you don't like a character in this game, they, they, all of them will change. All of them will become better. I promise. I guarantee it. I think in the uh, the what you call it that I was watching the, uh, the YouTube video the series thing, um, they they were talking about a character. Um, I think it started with T. And they like changed the pronunciation later. Like they made a note to say that they changed the pronunciation of that character's name. Yeah. I am not a bitch. I never been fruity. I take this giant axe that I'll stick it in the booty. more you are actually very lucky that you're a tank <laughs> I mean, I'll oh, run your recommendation by the way if, if you whenever there's like five guys actually more than three guys on your screen just you use your AOE if, I think you do oh maybe you don't no you okay never mind you don't have it yet. never mind Oh, 
Oh nice, I just started to give you your hunting logs there. I did it. Big, big experience. And there you go, you're level 10. Can't suck my dick. Phew. Which means now you can go do your Marauder's quest and get a new axe, I think. And a new skill. Pretty stone. What? This is where you get your plot armor. <laughs> Here, feel, think. Crystal Bearer. That's me. I am Hydalin. All made one. Your name is Heidi now. A light there once was that shone throughout this realm. Yet it has since grown dim. And as it hath faltered, so hath darkness risen up in its stead, presaging an end to life. For the sake of all, I beseech thee, deliver us from this fate. I'm just a nigga. What, like, what am I supposed to be doing? The power to banish the darkness dwelleth in the crystals of light. Journey forth and lay claim to them. So what, we get some cool jewelry? Is that, is that what's going on? You want me to, you want me to get some fancy rocks? You want me to get the chaos emeralds? That's basically it. <laughs> <laughs> that's a crazy you, iceberg. It, that's basically it. You get crazy rocks. Shall the, the more rocks you have, the more powerful you become. And there you go. Only believe for the light that, that's just like the, the story of your, of your growth, you know? But it's not the main story. Gotcha. Who the fuck was that? Who the fuck is he? Those guys are posers. <laughs> it's the other players. Go now, my child, and shine thy light on all creation. Cool. Awake again? Oh. Oops, I didn't mean to skip it, but... Aha! The poor creature's fury was kindled with cruel forethought. See this blade? I found it in the Gubu's back. Can I have it? I have seen knives of this kind before. They are most commonly used for the cutting of rope. Can I have it? It would appear our culprits are seafaring men of some persuasion. 
Piratical being the most probable. Is it everyone here a fucking pirate? In any event, you seem much recovered from your sudden affliction. You know, at level at level fifteen, I think you can become a ninja Ooh. if you wanted to. That'd be cool. I confess, I was rather taken aback when you collapsed at the very moment of our victory. Mayhap a surfeit of ether? No, it, listen, it takes a toll being this fucking G, all right? Sometimes I gotta take naps. I beg your pardon? A towering crystal? I'm sure I don't... Well, well. This has been a day of unexpected revelations. I must continue my investigation. In the meantime, I suggest you deliver this knife to your patron, along with a warning concerning the pirate's probable involvement in this murky business. Isn't everyone here a pirate, though? The days ahead yeah. promise little rest, <laughs> like... I fear. L Limsa is basically a, a town or a city made by pirates. Yeah, I was about to say, like, oh, the assailant might be a pirate. That's like saying the assailant is human. Yeah. <laughs> May our paths it cross really again is. under the light of the crystal. Because they are literally all pirates. It was a bunch of pirate groups that kept warring with each other, and one day, one big, big boob pirate decided to bring everyone together, and then poof. Ah it, yes. Limza was farmed. Blackbeard, Blackbeard came through, fucked everything up. Level six. Me tell me about level six. Beast gauge. Symbol indicates the clients in which it's pieces of Um read your job gauge description of the time. Wow, they're teaching you about that already? What the fuck is a beast gauge? Uh it... <laughs> Basically, later on, you'll get abilities that need a specific gauge, kind of like mana. Mm -hmm. But it, it's like, um, if you ever played World of Warcraft... Uh, like when I was a kid? <laughs> well, uh, hmm. Okay, I imagine a game where every time you attack, you, get, you gain like a meter, right? And then you can use that meter to do special attacks. That's basically it. No, no. Yeah, I am all the time. So I can go back and do my Marauder shit. Which I, I'm sure yeah. I don't need, but... Uh, you, you, you do need because the your class quest will give you skills at some point. I see. Alright. I think once you reach level 15, you'll do the level 15 quest and it will give you a special skill. I don't remember what skill it is, but yeah. You should always do them. There are people, I, I remember seeing people at level 40 or 45 that didn't have their, their specialization, specialization class unlocked because they were just not doing their class quests. Gotcha. And a specialization is basically your Marauder at level, at level 30, he will become a warrior, which is an upgrade of your class. And if you don't do your class quest, he will be a Marauder forever. And the Marauder is a lot weaker than the Warrior. Yeah, sure. I understand. Yishtola, that's what Oh, and don't be afraid to teleport all over the place, because you will gain more than enough money to fuck around. Yeah, Marv says something about gaining a lot of money, too. Yeah, you, you'll finish the main story with, like, a million gil or something. So yeah, you can teleport all over the place if you want to. When <laughs> when I first started playing this game, I didn't teleport at all. I was I was being a Scrooge, an absolute Scrooge. <laughs> I would walk all over the place. Whenever I couldn't, if it was too far away, I would take the airship. Literally, I would go to the taxiway, take the airship. I would hire chocobo porters to ride me around. <laughs> And then one day I got my chocobo, my own personal chocobo, and poof. When did you start playing the game? Uh, let me go check. <laughs> that long? <laughs> I 
I gotta go speak with some person. Two thousand and thirteen. Wow. All right. So you've been playing the game since basically it fucking came out. Yeah. I I got the original one, the original fourteen, before it was good. I played for like four months. I decided that the game was an absolute piece of shit, <laughs> and I was so angry that I, I deleted everything. I deleted my account, everything. That initial account doesn't exist. Then the uh, Realm of Warn came, and I made a new account, and poof, and, and now I'm still here. How, how old were you in 2013, though? I was 23. Yeah, um... Uh, I'm sure that, like, there was a, a growth period to where you realized, uh, like, the first version of the game is probably the, the worst version of the game. It, it was absolutely horrible i can only imagine it it was so bad and i was a final fantasy fanboy back then because i loved playing final fantasy 11 and they basically tried to make a final fantasy 11 2 but it was just horrible so bad the game was not finished at all isn't you couldn't even jump couldn't even jump wow. um couldn't even jump isn't it, wasn't there like a whole entire thing where like the first version of Final Fantasy XIV got like scrapped and like they built it into the lore? Yep. You, you saw the, the, the first cutscene that you see, the the meteor falling down. Yeah. That meteor destroyed Final Fantasy XIV, the original oh, one. That's cool. I can't like that. that it, it was the calamity. Um. And you know what? That calamity was supposed to destroy like the game and like the the whole world, but there's actually a story plot to why the calamity didn't destroy the world, and that's what you're gonna find out in this part of the story. What happened? How the hell are we still alive? What happened to the empire? The empire was basically the the Darth Vader. The Darth Vader guys back in 2014. <laughs> but for now, you're just del delivering cakes to people and pies to soldiers. <laughs> and Um, don't worry about buying gear, because at level 15 you'll get a... Um, you'll go into the tutorial area, like the, the dungeon tutorial area that will teach you the fine... the fine things about the gameplay. Mm. And they will give you a full set of, like, level 15 tank gear. And it's going to be really nice. It's going to be an amazing upgrade. Okay, cool. cool. Um... What I'm trying to do now is find me all these assholes, and I don't know where they are. I don't even think they're uh, marked on my map. That first guy definitely wasn't marked on the map. Uh, do you see the, those circles? The orange circles? That's oh, where the... you need to go. Oh! Yeah. Okay. They, they, they change, the, they, they change everything, like, so frequently. Mm-hmm. Okay. Back in the day, there weren't even circles like that. You would like... literally just have to look for them. And in a way it's a pain in the ass, but back then there were so many people playing that people would just like ask each other like, Hey, did, did you see this guy for this quest? And and people would help each other. It was really cool. Oh, and they are always marked. They will be marked. They will be marked with like a quest symbol. Oh, uh, no, no, that's just Chocobo Potter. Yeah. He may be outside. The first guy was outside. The first guy was like right here. Wait. You can zoom there. the map a little bit. 
Uh, I don't think so. I didn't see him. I I'm just looking at your your stream. So, but yeah, I think you should look outside. Since the other three are outside. So I think that one will also be outside. Like next to the wall or something. That. Oh, yes, this is what we go up there. Oh, yeah, there he is. My memory serves me well. Nice. It's a llama. <laughs> It's uh, a llama, he, he was sitting on the grass. Of course you would never see him. <laughs> I was told that the... They're not, but the Lullas are basically evil. Uh, yeah. If you ever go to Ulda, you'll see. Ulda is the this, the Lala city in the middle of the desert. And yeah. Ah, oh, there you are. Um, Without spoilers, I was told basically every betrayal that happens... Uh, that basically happens in the game is because of Alala. Well, not all of them, but the most shocking one is because of Lala's. Wow. It's true. And and it's basically because of the Lalas in like in, in Ulda, because Ulda is the city of merchants. So all the Lalas there are incredibly greedy. Fair enough, makes sense. And, and that's why they have this reputation of being evil. I am missing something here. There you are, you son of a bitch. Take your lazy ass back to work. There's a fade over here, so I'm not gonna do it. Now, where you running? Come, why, why you running? Come get this ass uh, uh. Those guys just killed a man. I'm not. Oh, nice, and therefore you're a hunting log. Lucky. Come on. Do the thing. Do the thing where we attack the assholes. I think you have a button to actually manually target people. I know, I do. I don't know what it's that just not working. <laughs> oh. I, I, I just pressed tab and my guy just... I don't know, target someone and I should press buttons. Maybe I should change my controller so I can help you a bit better. Let me see. The first time I ever tried to play with my controller it was trying to play a ninja and I just said, nope, I'm good. <laughs> oh. Because if you're a ninja, you, you need to do the, you know, the hand signs kind of like Naruto. And oh, you have really? to be fast at doing them, and it's really complicated to control them. With the well, today, maybe to you is going to be fine. Alright. What's the button to target people? <laughs> Shit. So, I kind of just look at them and then hit uh, whatever your select button is. But sometimes it just yeah. doesn't do anything. Let's see. What the fuck? Oh, it's the D-pad! Dude, it's the D-pad! Ah, I guess that's easy. Yeah. yeah. And, and then you you can cycle between, between guys with the D-pad. Easy. That's cool. The, the My biggest issue was trying to figure out how to get the... Use the damn hot bar on the controller. Uh, oh yeah, because you gotta like go into your settings and turn it on. 
and I couldn't find. There's like so many settings. I was like, I don't know where it is. Oh, and, and by the way, uh, here's another tip: if you are playing with the controller, uh, go to your character configuration. I think uh, actually no, no, it's not character configuration. It's uh, uh, wait, where the fuck? Where, where is it? <laughs> wait a minute. I'm being a noob. What was the thing again? Maybe it is character configuration. General. Oh yeah, yes it is. Okay, so go to the character configuration. Then on control settings, go to general, and then you it, you should have selected standard type, right? I just changed everything, so I don't know where to begin with. Oh shit. Uh, let me see. Uh, go to system. Okay, all okay, the way okay, to okay, the right okay. side. Yeah. Character right. configuration. And instead of putting having it on standard, put it on legacy type. Because legacy type is a lot better with the controller. Oh, it, it's the, the first button. Yeah, it's on legacy type. It's on legacy type? Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Good, good. J just in case, uh, because I know that my game started with standard type, and that's horrible with the controller. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna switch between. It's much. I, I feel like it's much easier to play the game with uh, mouse and keyboard, but uh, the way that I have to sit, I have to like lean forward in a really awkward position. It hurts my back. So. Well, uh, if someone tries to tell you that mm, that the controller is not a good way to play this game. Tell them to fuck off, because <laughs> some of the best players that I know, they play with a controller. So yeah, it, it's just a... Uh, the people who tell you that controller is no good is people that are like me, that they they are so used to playing MMOs with a mouse and keyboard that they cannot play anything with a controller. Um, but yeah, don't listen to them. Yeah, uh, I just I started off with mouse and keyboard, and I was like, oh, no, this is really intuitive. I'm just going to click whatever I want to do. Yeah, um, but this being the first MMO that I'm, like, actually trying to, like, go through, I don't hate this. This is much more enjoyable than I thought it was going to be. Well, it's, it's a comfy game to play from time to time, I think. Yeah. Uh, at least for now, because the story is nothing to write home about at the moment. But later on, you, you, you're going to be, like, your jaw is going to drop. <laughs> Um, and it, yeah, uh, I'm also you, you know, no need, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm the also, music guy, no, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 the music guy, no, yeah, the music guy, yeah, 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 yeah I'm playing all uh, his music. I turned the, the music down all the way, didn't get music all the way down, put his music on, uh, which definitely make it a more, much more enjoyable experience. Mm hmm. And now I need to find some uh, real hype music for when stuff gets serious. <laughs> Well, the in-game music is is nice at times. Well, it's really nice, but yes, since it's repeating all over, like over and over and over, it gets tiring, I guess. Yeah. Excuse you. Uh, sir. Uh. Oh, okay. So th that's a uh, if you if you look at your quest description, it says conf confront Severin and cast doubt on his actions. So when you see something that says slash and then a word, it's because you have to type it. You you select the character and then with your keyboard or however you you do it with a controller, you type slash and doubt. Oh, oh yeah, or you can go to the emotes and and select the doubt emote. But it's much faster if you just, you know, just type it. That's, uh, interesting. Uh, hopefully we had down most time. Where's it better anyway? Wow, you found it super quickly. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye to work, bitch. 
Oh, and by the way, uh, can you go back to those emotes? The uh, emote menu? No. Without selecting anything, I think I can do it here. Yeah. Bitch! Uh, let me also go to my emotes to tell you. Oh boy, I'm going back to mouse and keyboard. I don't know what anything is. <laughs> my emotes. Okay, if you ever go back to the your emote thingy, go to the tab that says special. It's up there. Mm -hmm. It should be it should be the third one. Yeah. Are you there? Yeah. No 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 no. No no, it's the other one. That one. That's that, the special one. You see the one that says change pose? Try to put that on your hotbar or somewhere so you can use it. I don't know how you do it on the controller. The the, the change pose mode is basically you you can change your character's stance. Oh, that's cool. Press a button combination to assign it in a in an action. Cool. Th that's actually a. Uh, how do I explain it? it? It's something to give your character your own personality. You know, because you can literally just change the way that you that you present yourself to the people. You know, you can be serious, you can be laid back. Okay, that's cool. It, it's a cool detail. It also works for for your weapon. If you have your weapon drawn, you can change your stance, your combat stance. Y'all really just gonna stay here and get uh, like let me get attacked? That's what I'm doing right. How do I like tea bag? It isn't. Glad I checked. These bars are so unnecessary. What bars? What are you referring to? The, the, the bars that are filling, like, it says that you're helping someone or something. Oh, yeah. It's like, come on, man, just, I'm here, just do, do what you gotta do. <laughs> oh, look, you're right, the, lady, the little ladybugs that you needed. Everything is completely different now. Uh, it's not so different that I can't figure it out, but it's a lot different. So now I'll need a wild dodo and a wounded Arocus and a megalophile, which I actually fought earlier, which is upsetting. A lot of people just play with the controller, but then they use the keyboard to go to the menus and stuff. Yeah, that's what I was doing earlier. Uh, I didn't realize that the... Uh... 
the uh so when when i had the hot bar up the uh computer version of the hot, uh, hot bar and then the uh, uh and then like the controller version of the hot bar like the crossbar uh they were overlapping each other and i didn't realize that also they were overlapping so yeah so like the the crossbar was on top of like the computer hot bar that's weird it's a and yeah, the, if I should do that, the the sprint is weak. Well, like, did we get better sprint or? Nah, you just got a mount at level twenty. The sprint is actually quite good, but in combat, like in high high end raids, because sometimes like you have to dodge an AOE. And maybe, I don't know, you made a mistake and you're in the wrong position. And sometimes if you use sprint and get into position, you can save yourself. But you, you don't have to worry about that. Yeah, you can start worrying about that at level 50 if you do want to try to raid a little bit. When did I hit level 1? When did we level 1? Well, each main story quest is like giving you half your experience bar almost. Well, I'm exaggerating, but yeah. And, and leveling a... Well, you're not going to do that for a new character, but imagine that someone, like a friend of yours, asks you to play with them. And I don't know, they live in another server and they ask you to play with them. Leveling that other character is a lot faster because you can just skip cutscenes and shit. And that's why I told you that the first 15 minutes are like... Uh, I mean, the first 15 levels are like just 15 minutes because you don't have to read anything, you don't have to watch any cutscene. And so it goes by really, really fast. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> I'm glad you told me about the, the fucking story quest, because I was really sitting here like, oh, I gotta do X, Y, Z, and yada, yada, yada. Oh, yeah, I was wondering why you were doing, like, random tiny little quests. Yeah, because I thought I could be able to continue to... The, the quests that you are doing are, are basically nice quests for whenever you are leveling up a, a new class or something. Because, as you, as you, I think you have been told, you can be anything in the game right yeah like one character i think be you all... even you even showed me that the one time where like you had like one class and yeah, you can... switched like eight other classes i can show you now look okay i'm, I'm a lancer right look now i'm a white mage oh but i don't have any skills i'm only level one like, uh, what about this now now i'm a summoner but i can't do i don't have any i don't have anything Shit. uh <laughs> now i'm a paladin i'm level one okay this guy still sucks yeah I can't show anything. Uh, the, your point was proven. Uh, what the hell is it going on now? Where is it? The opposite direction. Yeah. No, I think you're gonna fight another mini boss. I think. Yeah. Hey guys, how's it going? Come on, me. <laughs> oh shit. Let's see if you can. Let's see if you can survive. I'm actually interested. Uh. <laughs> you can do it. Come on. The tank. I'm, okay, I'm, gonna, I'm, 
Okay, I'm, I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna jump in. <laughs> I'm here, I'm here. Oh shit, run! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm, use, I'm stunning. How do you use like I stun this guy. Uh, to use items, you need to open your inventory, and then you can use them inside your inventory, or you can put them on your hotbar, and poof, it's like use potion, etc. Oh, there it is. Well, it should be I on your keyboard. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. And then... Yeah, you can either... Yeah. Cool. Alright, sweet. Now I have to worry Potions. about dying like that. Potions were so important back in the day. Some of these duties were really fucked up. Um, yeah, I, I can imagine how, how bad the game was, like, on the first versions. Well, the thing is, like, it being difficult, it, it didn't make it bad, right? It makes it a little bit more engaging. You have to think more. Like, you won't have any problem doing anything till, I don't know, maybe level 60-something. So, how good is like the magic in this game in comparison to like? Because I, Mar said earlier that there's no, uh, like magic tanks or anything like that. But so like how usually in Final Fantasy, uh, the magic's like busted. How is that compared to like this? Well, this game it. it... It has a, a PvP element, and not just that, like, for example, if a class is better than another, like, imagine that a mage class did more damage than, I don't know, a dragoon, right? Like a melee class. Of course, everybody will pick that mage class over the dragoon, because sure. it's ranged and you do more damage and blah, 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 etc., etc. So, and the game devs knew this. The game devs wanted people to play whatever the hell they wanted to play, right? right. And in order to do that, they needed to balance all the classes. So basically, all, all the classes are good. There's, there's no class that's like much, much better than another. No, they are really, really balanced. They only start not being balanced once you start reaching the ceiling the skill ceiling right? right but if you if you put a, a guy in the same in the same skill range as the other one playing two different classes they will be mostly the same so, so it, it's not like black mages are busted or something because for example a black mage can do a, a fire aga spell right and it will fucking destroy and annihilate one mob but a black mage will not give any buffs to the party you know, while a ninja will will have a skill that increases everyone's damage by like ten percent. So what is what is more valuable? Is it the black mage that can do big dick DPS, or is it the ninja that can do not as much DPS but can give a big boost to the whole party? You know, that there's there's that fine balance between classes. Oh, so even though black guys. mage. <laughs> Even though Black Mage is the best DPS, the best Mage DPS class, if you had a full party of Black Mages, you would suck. Your party would suck. That's the best way I can explain it.
And then you have examples like the Red Mage. You know how Red Mage is working, kind of fancy, right? Uh, that's like high offense, right? Uh, well, Red Mage is ba it's basically a mage that can use melee, and it can also use black magic and white magic at the same time. So it it's basically not good at anything, but it can do everything, yeah. you know? So a Red Mage, in theory, c will never be able to out, out DPS a Black Mage, right? right. But uh, the Red Mage has something that the Black Mage cannot do. Which is raise people. If you die, a red mage can raise you in like two seconds. While if you, if it's a black mage, you die and then you're like, oh well, what, what do I do now? I guess it's my turn next. Huh. So it's that type of utility that balances the class as well. That's why red mages are very good for learning for me, but for a, a big boss that needs for 8 people or something. Sometimes it's nice for that party to have the red mage just to be the, the reviving guy. What is Defiance do? Because I didn't actually get to see what that did. Uh, Defiance makes so every attack that you do gains aggro. Oh, okay, so that's that's a tank stance. Alright. Exactly, it's a tank stance. So if you go into a dungeon with people, like you're the tank, so you have to take the hits, you need to have your tank stance on. Else you will lose aggro to the DPS. Unless you do more damage than the DPS, but that's normally not the case. Maybe it will be the case at the beginning, since you know people don't know what they're doing. But later on it will be next to impossible to tank without the tank stars on. I don't think you're gonna leave that place because they will keep you spawning. No. Oh. I thought this is what I had to be doing. No, you already you're done. Oh, okay. <laughs> you're <ready. laughs> wow. You have to deliver something. So, can I read it? Deliver the reclaimed farm tools to. Piff? Piff wall? Pit wall? Yeah. I can't read it. Well, then I'll fucking lose my fucking Oh, well, apparently I can. Oh, I can. Uh, click in the left, uh, left stick, and that'll, uh, target as well. Oh. That's cool. That doesn't even exist on, on the PC. Mouse and keyboard. That lock-on function. Remember, teleport is your friend. <laughs> uh, fair enough, but I'm already over here. Yeah, I, 
could, I could, I could see what they're doing. At least in this version of the game, because when I when I first saw Final Fantasy, it was like the 2013 version. I was also very was... offended because uh, I saw how the really the big dick CGI C uh, CGI trailers, and I was like, the game doesn't work like this. Felt like dude. The only thing that the game had that was good was literally the the CGI and the cutscenes. The cutscenes in that game were very, very good. They were basically cinematic cutscenes. Here there are some cinematic cutscenes too. But I still think that they don't look as good as the ones in 2013. That's high praise. But considering that that's the only thing that game had. It's yeah, it's literally the only thing. I did your thing, or did your dirty work? Did a what? Oh, I'm talking to the, the, the guy. Oh. Damn, a new axe. Yeah, but you can get a new axe from the, doing the thing, right? So. That's true. Uh. You're familiar with this kind of survey, serving by now. Scheme and escape good. Scheme and escape good is at it again. So, uh, it's just that what I can't bring myself in. He's running up his roads and putting it off. Very well done. You gonna go find that asshole? All right, let's go find that asshole. <laughs> Insolence. A nice place, big as hell. Ugh, then again, my criteria for a nice place is doesn't have a lot of space. You know, if you explore Limsa and you actually read the dialogue boxes that appears in NPCs, you will find that it's not a, a very nice place. <laughs> it, well, There's actually. Right. Like I said, there's my criteria a bar. for nice places is do you have a lot of space? There's a bar in Limsa that is run by female female par, uh, pirates. And basically, they see every man as a piece of meat and they say it. Wow. <laughs> it's basically a, a dom. A dom <laughs> cafe. <laughs> um. Yeah, when Mar was and here earlier, a... I think you had already left to, to go um, to, for your stream. Um, uh, I was like, I, I, she was like, oh yeah, you could be anything in this game. And I was like, can I be a hoe? She's like, yes. <laughs> I was like, wait, no, I was kidding. You could be a hoe in this game. But it's true, you can. Oh, uh, no. You really can. My sister used, used to... Uh, to help this a, is not a, a good bar. statement immediately after saying it. <laughs> what, what is she, Nairo? <laughs> she, she, she helped with the... Uh, what was it? Uh, she, she wasn't the hoe. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> I think it was, it was with the publicity and the bar. I think she would, she would, she would sell stuff. Uh... Hostess? Uh, yeah, I think it's a hostess, but it, it's not a hoe. It, it wasn't a hoe. Um, and they, they would actually pay her. She got a bunch of money for doing that. That's crazy. Yeah. I do find the, uh, like I said, I wasn't really ever in it, but I do find it interesting that I can just teleport there. That's not Um... Maybe one day I'll take you to a club. I'm not a club <laughs> expert, but I know that they exist. Yo, this game is fucking wild. Yeah. Um, but what jokes streams? aside, you... Um, listen, you can actually pay for company. That's wild. Like, you know, RP. 
ERP company. <laughs> um, one of one of the streamers that I watch uh, said, "Oh yeah, I'm gonna I'm taking a, a, a break off from uh, from doing streams for a while. I have to go to a Final Fantasy 14 wedding." And I remember at the time, my mind was fucking just blown. I was like, "What do you mean? <laughs> mm -hmm. What do you mean?" And and some people take those weddings really seriously. And some people who have wed in the game have wed in real life too. That make that makes a, a lot more sense for in terms of uh, taking the wedding seriously. But like my, my my high school mind at the time it was like 2015. I was like I can't fathom this. <laughs> well, let, let's just say that I I think it was. Uh, 2014, I think, maybe 15. Uh, I, I met a girl in this game, and she was always talking about, oh, marry, marry that, marry that, uh, get the. And if you marry, you get a a big chocobo, you know, a white big chocobo that it can take two people, so you can drive people around with you. Oh. And at some point, I was just like, all right, do you want to marry me? And poof. And then we divorced two years later. <laughs> well, and I got the house. I was about to say, who kept the chocobo? Oh, uh, it was two chocobos. One, one for each oh, person. Oh, okay. That's nice. But we did have a house, and I kept it. And I said, fuck you. I'm taking the house. These motherfuckers can't fight. This is like the second time, the same day. <laughs> oh shit, I know this quest. All right, I'm going. Okay. Uh, it's just level I have to. Back, so you'll be, uh, yeah. This band. You just have to talk to the, the quest thing again. You, you couldn't get in because I was in a party with you. Oh. It's a solo duty. Oh, okay. Every time you see those quests with a little light, it's because it's a duty. Okay. And the duty is a fighting quest scenario, you know. Okay. It's part of the story. Yo, Kratos? <laughs> That's the Walmart Kratos. <laughs> <laughs> um, you were prepared to over, uh, overlook the matter uh, of your dissertation on the condition that you provided us with suitable replacements. That was the agreement. And yet your latest change of heart leaves you, your, your debt uh, to us unpaid. Few are uh, they who have betrayed the serpent reavers twice. You would not stand. Uh, you not do so a third time. Hi. My undertone is very red. Cowering behind the protect protector will only delay the inevitable armless wrench. Wretch. Uh. Yo. You fucking. You didn't even get the tattoo right, you fucking. Knock up. I'm taking your mask. Oh, mourn for a voice of creation. Send unto me a creature of the abyss, my throne to command. That I may smite my enemies. Bro, why do you smile like that? Like, how you know I didn't summon that? How you doing? Hi, how you doing, buddy? Strong, but are you strong enough to withstand this? Yeah, especially if you miss, dumbass.
kicked his ass now. Dude, I'm kind of distracted here in your limbs a little bit. <laughs> I, I, li I like this place. I'm trying to, to show you a screenshot. But I don't know, I don't I don't remember what my screenshot photo is again. <laughs> it's always happening, god damn it. Where did I put it? That man is no ordinary adventure. Yeah man, my dick is huge. You know, at my point in the story, that's really the only thing that, that they haven't said to me yet. <laughs> Next a little way. I'm glad he did not have a chance to sink his fangs more deeply into you. Well, I mean, I'm sure it's plot relevant, so. Yeah, I'm gonna take a nap right here. Those pirates do not uh, belong to any of the known women's infections. Uh, whom do they serve? The beast tribes? Surely not. But the timing of their appearance go coincides all too neatly with the recent surge of Sagan uh, and Kobold activity. Something is afoot. The question is what? Could it be that the tribes are planning to summon their primals? Yes, that's exactly what they're doing. Twelve help, uh, twelve help us if it should prove so. Limzo would be hard pressed to keep a single primal at bay, let alone two. But all is yet speculation. I must, uh, need, I must needs find evidence. There was a Powerpuff Girls comic published by DC. That's not what. <laughs> Hey man, I found a I found my screenshot folder. Okay. I sent you what I what I was checking out <laughs> in your Linza. I was like, damn. I was just walking down the street and suddenly <laughs> I didn't know what to do. <laughs> uh, for bond watchers, uh, he's. Just walking down the street and see all two chicks in bikinis, just chilling there. Why? It's too succubus, man. Look, look at those wings. <laughs> They're succubi. The coming, uh, coming of chaos has rendered the laws of nature immutable, blurring the boundary between the material and aether planets. Little now stands between us and the primals. But he, uh, Bahamut was a primal, right? Yeah, Bahamut was a primal. So one problem will fuck everything now. Never did Primals kind of have their tears, you know. Okay. Some so, problems are, are bitches. Okay. Uh, never did I dream that I would possess the means to see either. Yet now that uh, now that I do, I do begin to take for take it for granted how swiftly the wonders of Char uh, Charlie seem commonplace. Flower girl. Aerith? Wait, is that Aerith? Hold on. There you go. Are you coming from the stimmies? <laughs> Today's maelstrom officially makes the, the great hole in the sea its training ground. Join the celebration. Oh, you're right. It is an Aerith throwback, isn't it? Oh, by the way, I don't know if you have good memory or not, but sometimes random characters that appear in the story, they actually grow up and they become their own person. That's cool. Sometimes you just see, oh, this is that person that I saw, like, <laughs> last year. My skin is very red. Uh, can you walk? Yeah, I can. I'm good. I'm chilling. Oh, okay. You're talking to him. All right. Did you just get a call? Regrettably, no. He eluded me. Understood. I will form the com uh, the commodore. The 
blood from your exertion, so you suitably recover. Yeah, man, I mean, being this amazing takes some time. Servant here has appraised me of uh, all that transpired. He, his account shed some light upon how you came to be attacked by the golem of all things. But I whooped its ass! The golem is a mindless hop uh, automaton. Inert save wouldn't command it to be. Otherwise, uh, common pirates could not hope to control such a thing, so arcane is our, our its workings. But these tattooed wretches are no common uh, pirates. They are minions of Salhe. Salhe. Salhagen! Uh, as to the purpose, I should get to the bottom. Best escort Severin back to his place of employment. I dare say, still, uh, still work. Uh, we'll be wondering what has become of him. You two, for that matter, I will bear a word with him. Uh, bear a word to him in your preser. Why can't I read? Preservation. But I am certain he would like to thank you in person. Pray, pay me the uh, pay man. The man of visits. Jesus Christ. Also, uh, homeboy's weapon's stupid. But perchance did you not tell me uh, tell you of me? My name is Ishtola. I am that. Uh, that's yep. not a weapon. Well, uh, it's a tool, but like tools are weapons. Yeah, it's a botany axe. It's a what now? A botany axe. It, it's to chop wood. Yeah. Um, I mean, people use tools as weapons all the time, like nunchucks, uh, scythes, sickles. Um, a naturalist of sorts surveying the aether and hope that it might offer some clue to all the decadence. I'd say I owe you my life, but that doesn't count for the one for you. My friends be dead and all. Because the dead I can never pay. But I'll not make things worse by running away. Take me to some uh, some Fort Farms and I'll face the consequences. For reasons I cannot fathom, you seem forgiven. Mayhap we shall uh, have a chance to speak again when I have marshaled my thoughts. Until I pass across again. I can just teleport there. Sweep. Hello. <laughs> I thought that said lol. <laughs> lol, I knew you'd be here. Be you return. Uh, there's also what I assume a Batman comment that seems to involve PPG Dexter, Dexter Slab and Jenny XJ Nat from Teenage Robot. What was that into? That sounds like that one, uh, that one Cartoon Network crossover game. You told it to live with the servant a bit ago. Tells if your whole life needs to proceed to. Those came shuffling back too. A lot of them sporting the same haunted expression. Speaking back for that. I was once a serpent reaper. Yep. The reapers may look and sound and act like pirates, but they are not but uh, the fish backs of flunkies. Us pirates ain't much for laws, but there's things we won't do. We got a code, see? But the re reapers never followed a word of it. A few years back, they started uh, snatching law by the Lomna said, so that explains the, uh, the kidnappings. I had only taken my oath when our captain bent the knee to his new style. Sahag Sahagin Masters. I knew I had to get away. So I crept off one night, got myself a new name, found myself a new home, some of farms. Trouble is, secrets don't stay secret for long around here, and with words and sped, and all the way back to the sea. The penalty for uh, dissertation is death, but the reefers offered me a way out instead. My freedom exchange for my mates. I don't know what I was thinking. I wasn't... Okay, well, yeah, yeah. alright, alright. But in the end, uh, you got here in the end, and when the time came, you made the right decision. The men say little to me, but I hear them talk about how you stood up for the Reapers, uh, set up to the Reapers up there, uh, at the last. How you tried to give your life to save theirs. But that as it may, no deed, however good, can atone for my crime of betraying the brethren. I know that, I do. That is why I'm going to hand myself over to the Yellow Jackets. I'll bring uh, shame to the farm, though. You're here to argue with me? Each man has to sail according to his own moral compass. Yay! 
Ganon's right. I <laughs> hope your guy, I uh, hope yours got you back here someday. There will be a place for you at some point. I'll always be in your deck. Are you a deck too? Now, once have you let me down? Thank you, saving my man. Uh, tell homeboy what you did. Okay. Not that. I keep doing that. Bye. Last chapter out has the girls of putting Jenny in the, in the Dynamo robot going to Pied Mojo Jojo in, in, a, in a robot Jones style robot. Dexter is uh, basically the guy in the chair. That sounds kind of lit. Said in the punishment is a good of mine. If I ask him nice, I reckon he'd be willing to commute the lead sentence and, 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 uh, from Angan to me, call on Kamu Jetty. What the fuck? I'm not, I can't. But as a reward, she's a lonely lady, drowning, uh, the sure don't work fine. I'd fancy to keep her company for a spell when you run the board. Yeah, sure, I'll, I'll use a river. Yeah. It actually looks so well made. He's crazy. It looks like a Western manga. Drop some pics in the uh, pics in the Discord. Our guild draws. Oh, you, what? you got your new room. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. It might be a good idea to whenever you stop playing the game to log out inside your room because it gives you more rested experience. Ah. Rested experience is like a. A percentage bonus for everything that you do yeah, in the game. That earlier. Yeah. Um, before I go talk to him, I'm gonna go get myself a room. Stop that. Alright, where's T Pain? T Pain? That's not T Pain. Where are you? Where's the chip? There it is. Okay. Oh, since we're here in Limsa, you could also go get your Marauder's Quest. Yeah. Since you're at level 10. A new axe would be good. And if you want to, you could even abandon that quest that you have, just to, to no, have no, your no, quest off screen. How you gonna come the exact moment I stop playing your music? How you gonna do that? <laughs> what were you saying, Aaron? Uh, I was saying that if you wanted to, like, just to get your. Oh, never mind. You're just gonna deliver it right now. Okay, never mind. I was gonna say that you, maybe you could delete some of the quests that you're not gonna do for now. 
that just keep your like your screen clean. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. No, I hate having shit on uh, on uh, just on the screen at all times. Yeah, same. Thanks for repping my shit. I uh, thanks for having good shit. How about that? Uh, or I love the teleport noise. <laughs> Big of the new avatar. Glad you. Uh, glad you like it. Um. Yeah. I think I mentioned to you the, uh, the scene earlier, but uh, while you were jamming out last night, this is what I was doing. If you have a, uh, another session, so, uh, I'm probably gonna. I gotta redo a few uh, avatars. Yeah, no, I, I I saw that you put them in there. Like, I didn't. Uh, I haven't seen them yet, which is why I didn't say. The fuck? Where? Where is? Where? Don't they? Oh, w w whenever a quest has like a, a how, how do I say it like a little border on it like you see that that big border and the, with some letters yeah that means that the quest is in that direction it's in a whole new map oh gosh. it's in lower la Nocia. oh yeah that's why I'm like what the fuck I don't yeah you get an avatar and beta bet Uh, how long it take you, bro? That giant monster is a hunt, like a, a hunt mark. Yeah, the and it the big level fifty guy. Yeah. It, they give you special currency that you can then use to I don't know get get a bunch of things. I don't know what my fucking. Oh, yeah. 
Mm, can you click in the sky high quest? I mean, that's not the thing I'm trying to do right now, though. Oh. What you looking for? Um. So the the first quest right uh, on the right there is to slay Galag uh, slay uh, Galagos, and then on the bottom right, I guess speak oh. the mode. But I'm trying to do the stop one right now, and I don't know. It sent me over here, uh, right? I don't know. It, it's not that way. It's north. it's north. If you look at your mini map, you'll see a blue arrow and um, and an orange arrow. The orange arrow is where your quest stuff is. And the blue arrow, uh, I think it's a fate? No, I'm not sure. I don't remember what the blue arrow is. Yeah, it looks like it's the distant fate. Yeah. Oh, well, th there you go. So blue arrow is the fate and orange arrow is your quest. Man, it'd be real nice if the fucking game told me, hey, this is what this does. I'm not sure why, but in my minimap, my main quest arrow also has like a little icon. Like it has the arrow and then an icon. I don't, I don't know why it's different for you. Uh, it's probably because I changed the uh, the layout. Or maybe because it's not the main story quest. Oh look, the dodo! The dodo that you were looking for. Oh, right there, yeah. on your left. I bet you're it. I bet you're there. Dead. Once you kill all of them, you will unlock the level two hunting. And no, I, I, I still need another thing. Oh, one. There's one left. I see. Uh, I still need the the crab. The crab. The crab should should be somewhere in a river. Or maybe it's in land. Costa del Sol? I'm trying to remember where they are. Yeah, I fought the crabs earlier, but it didn't count because I didn't have this yet. So. Ah, oh, I see. Um, Naro, your stream, your stream was hilarious yesterday. We were uh, playing Resident Evil with your buddy. Um, that's what Danny's is talking about. Yeah. Oh, you, you play with, whenever, uh, with Lozada, right? Yeah. Whenever I play a game like a game like that with him, it, it's almost not safe for Twitch. Almost. <laughs> <laughs> well, then this, that's the best content. What in the shit is that? Yeah, no, I'm hit. I made a hard swerve on that man. Nah, I'm good. Oh yeah, and then though those like big ass hunts, they have ranks. There's B rank, there's A rank, and then there's S rank. And the bigger the rank, the the harder it is. Like some of those fights, you need like whole servers fighting it. Well, not at the moment, not anymore. But back in the day, you had. You had like 60 people or more, a hundred people fighting a single monster. It was really cool. Uh, yeah, that must have been insane. Aha. Well, they still like hunts that need a lot of people still exist, but now it's only in the 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 expansion area. So. Yeah, no, it, it's kind of funny whenever one of those hunts they have they have some kind of mechanic and people usually don't know what the mechanics are and so suddenly 30 people die in front of you <laughs> all right cool. oh and thanks no need i forgot to say thanks thanks for the compliment no need i'm bad at Taking compliments. <laughs> Thanks. Um, I think I could just teleport back. But I don't know who, who homeboy is at the bottom. Oh, 
What is this? I'm glad I put over because I needed to come here. Apparently. Oh, I see. I need to get the sky lift. The sky lift will take the blue area. Uh, uh, I'm not sure. I think the lift just brings you up the mountain. I don't remember. How I played your music for for actually like five hours, and the moment you show up is when I stop playing your fucking music. What kind of shit is that? What'd you eat for dinner, Nate? Uh, Nate? Uh, I think it was a burger. Burger and shitty rice. Burger and rice. Okay. Because they decided to put uh, what's the what's it called in English? That thing that you use to make popcorn. <laughs> what is it? Corn. Yeah, corn. Oh, <laughs> no, corn. corn. Okay. That's right. <laughs> yeah, they they put corn on the rice, and I hate when they do that. So it was shitty rice. Uh -huh. I was like, how do you make popcorn? Oh, with corn, that's right. Well, to be fair, I was I was also like, what the fuck are you want about? <laughs> <laughs> I, I've been doing the tutorial, by the way. Like, to get that piece of gear that I told you about. Ah. So I don't look like an idiot. What are the fire sharks do? Uh, the fire shards are for crafting. It's it's the one of the the items that you will always need to craft stuff. Like for example, you want to make a new sword, you need iron, uh, an iron plate. And then you need fire shards. Okay. The higher the level, the more shards you need. Oh, and each crafting class needs oh, that's a different the thing. shard. That's, those are the fucking crafts I want. Look at that damage. <laughs> um, I mean, that's what we're kind of in the middle of doing right now. 
Uh-huh. Damn, look at that experience. Did you see that? That was almost your full HP bar. Uh, HP. Experience bar. What the fuck? The fucking hyenas from, uh, live came up here out of nowhere. On this after. Shit, we'll be closer. I think after you deliver that quest, you'll be level 14. Oh yeah, probably. played this game for so long that it's not really a game that I'm like, oh, I'm going to play Final Fantasy XIV. It, it's more of a, a chat room. Does that make sense? You're not playing it for uh, a game, you're playing it for a social aspect? Yeah. Because I've been playing it for so long that I have a bunch of friends here, you know? Yeah, alright, fair enough. Like, I, I do play it whenever there's a, a new expansion or... A, a new story patch because I I do like the story and whenever I have time I also do the rates the high-end rates but I don't think I will have time to do that now all right fair enough what's your uh, new uh, job <sighs> it's at the airport and it's basically I'll, I'll explain Imagine that you are 70 years old and you can walk very well, right? Right. You, you can walk long distances, so you need some help. And so my job is to check your flight, see if you're there. And if you're there, I'm going to send someone to your flight with a wheelchair to come and get you. To make and help you do whatever the hell you need until you are out of the airport. Sounds relatively easy. To use. Uh, it depends. It depends on the situation. And but that's like the most basic stuff, right? There's people with mental problems. There's people 
uh, I don't I don't know so every single thing that can make it hard to move around we have to deal with it you're blind you can't hear you can't listen very well you're old you broke your leg you I don't know you were born with some kind of defect blah 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 if you can't go down the stairs you need you'll need a, a portable elevator that we have so yeah it's basically helping people that can't help themselves there you go I did it I finished the, the tutorial quest I don't know what this is hmm what let me see where are you Uh, we need to go to Swift first, but I don't know what that is. Oh! Oh shit, uh, okay, let me see, I need to check my map. Swift Perch is... Uh... Can you click on your... I don't think you can, because you're in the, with the controller. I can always you, you just need go to... back to the... the Take the boat. Or... What? Take the boat. You can take the boat there. Oh, uh, well, before I do that, I'm gonna go finish the Marauder boat. Yeah, yeah, do that first. Yeah, yeah. After that, go to the port, and there should be a Lala there, I think. Well, pff, so someone with the boat. And take the boat to either to Ale port or Swift port. One of them. If there's no Swift port in the options, just go to the Ale port because it's the, the same map. Oh, and you'll be able to see my new clothes. <laughs> These actually look quite good. Uh, you can also teleport around in town. You don't need to walk all over the place. Like, if you touch the main crystal in town, you can teleport to the, all of the other small crystals. As long as you have attuned to them. So, I can use the teleport for the Aether Gem. Uh... Yeah. So you see that Aether Shard? If you click on it, you'll attune. And then you can use it to go to where you need to go. Okay, no, this I did. I just don't, I don't know where I'm going, which is why I... Have yeah, just click that thingy, and now you can select the the shard that you want on the map. Yeah, that I did. I didn't. I don't know where I'm going, which is why I didn't. So I, I'm just trying to figure out like this is. Okay, that is not the way. Is it not? No, that it, it is a port, but I don't think it's going to take you to where you need to be. That that's like the main port. It will only take you to other towns. Like for example, now right now you're in the Limsa Lominsa area, and that boat will take you to Tanaland or the Central Shroud, which are the other main cities in the game. Uh, you should go to the the Fisherman's Guild. That's a good one. Actually, no, 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 no. You want to go to the Marauders Quest first, right? I finished. I finished what I needed to do there. I need to go do the other part of the quest now. Okay, then go to the Fisherman's Guild. I think it's the closest. The closest hat right to the the boat that I'm telling you about. This thing. Yeah. Okay. Now, do you see on your minimap? There's like a little boat sign on your minimap. Uh, no, that, that's not the way. Back. What the fuck? What? Hello? Yeah, that's the big boat, but you don't want the big boat. You want no, the small like, boat. No, what is happening with this dude? Oh, what? Oh, well, they are pirates. They're fucking with. They're fucking with him. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Oh, and fun fact. Inside that boat, there is a, a very specific jump that you can do, and you can clip out of the map. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wrong way. It's back. If you go that way, you're going back to the main city. Back. So 
small boat here? It, it sh there should be on your minimap an icon of a small boat. Look right there, I can see it. Right there, it's the fairy skipper guy. I, I knew it was Lala. Uh, Aleport. I just need to make sure I'm not playing copyright music. Mm -hmm. I need to be level 15. What? What? Take the boat? Wow, bullshit. They're racist. See, man, the Lalas are evil. <laughs> racist Lalas. All right, well, then the... I don't know. I, I guess you, sh you could teleport to... Uh, middle Anostia to Summer Fourth Farms and then just walk where you need to go. Which should be north of Summer Fourth uh, Summer Fourth Farms. Oh, hello. What the fuck? What in the shit is that? That's a Dark Knight skill. It's an AOE. Oh, you're, oh, you're talking about the, the giant mount. I was talking about the mount, yeah. That's Omega. It, it's one of the final mounts of one of the raid tiers. Oh. Back in the day. Okay, had a whole ass transformer. Yeah. Okay, now just go north. Follow the arrow. Yeah. The, the arrow shows the way. I think, I hope. I mean, the story quest is the sudden looking thing, isn't it? So. Yeah, but uh, I know if you go in that direction, you will reach where you need to be. Yeah. Actually, maybe I can... Uh, friends... Invite... There you go, maybe I can meet you halfway. <laughs> Your level and stats do not show up on my thing right now. Yeah, it's because I'm not on the same map. Ah. Where the fuck am I? <laughs> God damn it. Okay, it's Western Alasia. Alright. I'm like looking at my game and your game at the same time to situate myself. Ah. Stuns in this game are so good. Uh, yeah, I'm the burning. It's even better whenever there's like a, a round AoE and your party has mages. And mages have cast times, right? So they have to stay put to cast a spell. So you can actually save them from getting hit if you stun at the right time. Yeah, that is pretty... That is pretty good, yeah. Where am I going? Oh, I want to go. Need to go back to the farm still, but uh, keep, keep going north. It's fine. I, I think, honestly, at this point, I think you should just go back to the Marauders Guild once you reach level fifteen, because you are already so close to it. Sure. And then you can just do like two quests at once.
Oh shit, I, I was speaking, but I was, <laughs> I was muted. Look at me, look how good I look now. I don't look like a hobo. Look at this shit. Yeah, you do look a lot better. You are tiny. Finally. Hey man, you, you're like huge. <laughs> you're one of the, <laughs> the biggest races in the game. <laughs> yeah, I tried to make myself my actual height. And uh, I tried to like scroll down. I was like, no, they're, they're taller. This game is bullshit. They don't let cat boys be more be taller than. Uh, oh shit! I don't know how much it is in feet. Okay, wait a minute. Wait. You can say it in. You can say it in. Uh, uh, centimeters. A uh, hundred and seventy-four centimeters. That's I cannot point. be more than that. That's a rough like. That's close to like that's five higher end of five foot lower six foot. That's tiny even for me. That's all I do. Well, my... I, I went to... Uh, how do you say it? Whenever your ID is almost out of... Ex expiration? Expi yeah, expired. Yeah, so I went to renovate it. I think that's what it is. And they had to measure me, and it looks like I'm actually 177 centimeters. I thought I was 175, but no. I, I, I guess I grew I grew two centimeters. Hmm. Uh level quest. So this ain't a level quest. Uh no, you, you can just quit that shit. Like, don't don't bother with that. Okay. Yeah, that that's like a, a complete waste of time. That, that's something that was good back in the day, but now it's just a freaking waste of time. You can just quit it. Uh, 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 see what it, what it says, leave quests on your quest there. Y no. You are on the, in the right screen. Yeah. You are um, on the right screen. Yeah, I, was, I hit the shit on my screen. I hit anyway. Oh. Um, yeah, leave quests. What am I doing here? Uh, just remove it from your your quests. The, the thing that says grabbing crabs. I, I don't know how to do it in the control room. I don't know if you can just scroll to the quest and remove it. Let me see. Let me let me try with my controller. Oh, there you go. Can't you just scroll to it? I mean, I can go over to it, but I can't. I can't. Let me see. I'm gonna accept one just to see. Accept. Alright, let me see. So I'm in a quest. Okay, I use my D-pad to scroll to it. I press X on it, and my X should be A to you, I guess. And then on the right side, there should be a button that says Abandon. <laughs> you only have Initiate. I think it's because it's your first one. Yeah, well, I can ignore it, so that's, that's fine. Yeah. Alright. Um, somewhere up and down, I don't want to... It is hot as fuck in here. What is going on? Alright. Um, occasionally my AC does not like to work. And that's what's happening right now. It is so hot. It's blowing hot air. And you leveled up and the, the quest gave you like 25% of your experience. <laughs> You're so lucky. Back in the day, we really had to do all the those shitty quests that you were doing. I was trying to play the game the old G way. Yeah.
sometimes you you would even do all the quests and you wouldn't have enough experience to level up to the level that you needed to be. And because of that, you had to do fades. Had to do fades, have to do leaf quests, which is that thing that you just abandoned. Is this just me or one of those fat dodos as part of your hunting logs? Uh, not anymore. That was the big one. Look, look at that big one. The fat one. Fat dodo. Yeah, not anymore. But they're there. Look, they have the symbol. All right. Yeah, you, you're, you're on hunting level 2. Yeah, you've cleared level 1. So now these are actually new. New hunting things that you need to do. I could even help you. I mean, I'm just doing the fake because it's here. It's in the, it's in the way. Oh, yeah. The thing here is to destroy the nest, not the dodos. Here I am! I'm, I'm doing so much more damage now. Uh. Okay, you take care of the all everything, and I'll I'll kill the nest. If we just kill Dodos here, then it, the fate will not end. Oh shit. I wasn't fast enough. Yeah, fates have a time limit. 
any sense on this thing. Let's see if I can help you. Did it count? Uh, let's find out. Uh, it did count. Good. What kind of mole is that? Uh, wait a minute, I need to refresh your stream because I'm getting behind. There. Now I'm a bit more caught up. There, halfway from fifteen. Yeah, when I when I go back and finish this, it'll probably be done. What the fuck? Oh, that was looking at screen. Damn man, it's already 3 a.m. How the fuck? I haven't done anything today except this game. I wish I could do that. <laughs> man, I mean, my bank account hurts right now though, bro. I have no money. If only we didn't need money. Right? If only we just got like, I don't know, 400 bucks every month. 400 there you bucks go. Every, like, that would be enough to pay for my car, I don't believe it. But it would be enough oh, yeah. to survive. I forgot about the college and shit. Yeah. Dude, 400 bucks, 100 for rent, 100 for food, 100 for games. There you go. I mean, 104 electricity and water and whatever. In in the in the world that we live in, I'm surprised like most of them aren't just inherently free. It's true. Like, what the fuck you gotta pay for water? Yep, that that's 100 percent true. Well, it's basically because we need to pay for the maintenance of the gear that gives us water. But yeah, I I, I understand. Uh, I'm gonna teleport back. Mm -hmm. What level is your quest? I don't know. I'm fucking dumb. To check your quest level, you just need to go to your your quest log, and it you like the the level of whatever quest you you have. It's the the best way to figure out like at which point in the game you are. They have so many menus. That's crazy. Uh, it's I mean it's the same uh, menu except yours. Is just, um. Okay, level it's two. level eleven. Oh, level eleven. Yes. No, 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 no. Yeah, level level, level 11. eleven. Yeah, the study quest is level eleven. Very well. Um, I'm at level seven. At level 16 or 17, I think. Actually, no. At, at level 15, 
you'll be you'll gain the, the ability to leave Limza and go check all the other cities. And then at level 17, you'll be able to go to your first dungeon. Alright. And maybe I'll go with you. And dungeons are like instance areas where you have to have a party of four four people, a tank, a healer, and two DPS. And it's it's the area where you can actually die if you're not careful. But m maybe you'll be playing and I'll, I'll be able to go with you. So you won't be like too nervous because, you know, you're the tank. So you're the one who tells people when to go. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um. Hey man, I didn't even know I was a tank the first time I played this game. Fair I just enough. thought that everyone but I just thought that everyone was a pussy. Like why why am I <laughs> why, why am I the one attacking? That, yeah, why why do I have to start all the fights? Why? Why am I the one that has that has to get hit every by every single enemy? And I remember once I just said, You can you can go. <laughs> and the people on my party were like, What what are you talking about? I'm tired. I'm tired of being the the one initiating fights. You guys go. One of you go. And then those party members explained to me what being a tank is because I had no <laughs> idea. I, I just thought there was damage dealers and healers. That's it. I had no concept about tanking. Um, I mean, I have an idea of like how all the classes work and like how they work with each other, but. Uh... I have no experience with that because most of the time I've played any kind of anything where that mattered. Uh, I was by myself. So. Yeah, it's single player games, yeah. That's the Armor Guild. I mean, you I can, can learn how. To... Yeah, you can join. Well, if you want to, if you want to, you know. Start crafting, you can. But you kind of need a lot of money, unless you decide to also level up a gathering skill. Last question? There is 15! Some, there are some uh, actions which can only be learned by completing specific class quests, for example, here's some tons of food by answers. Okay, so what did I get though? Oh, yeah. That, that's the thing that I told you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got provoke. You got provoke, yeah. Provoke is the skill for all tanks. Because in in high tier fights, there's gonna be two tanks, and sometimes the tanks need to like to ping pong the the boss between each other to avoid insta death stuff. So it's really cool. Provoke is the most important skill. For example, imagine that you're fighting, I don't know, Ifrit, and I'm, I'm just saying a random name. You're fighting an Ifrit, and the Ifrit is charging a, a big attack, and I'm tanking. I get hit by that big attack, and that big attack gives me a debuff, which makes it so I die to any attack after. What do we do to avoid that? The second tank provokes the boss away from me, and then he takes the other attack that was supposed to kill me. And then I take the boss back with my provoke. That's like a, a simple mechanic. That's the most simple mechanic that I'm explaining. There's other things that you need to do with provoke, but yeah, it doesn't matter at the moment. I don't think I actually touched this song. I think I'm sort of have to go over here. I gotta go the long way around. Oh, uh, wait a minute. D did you get the the quest yeah. from the Marauders Guild? Yeah, I you think. did? I think so. But I, not. I don't think you did. No, you don't. <laughs> you didn't. You need to go back to the Marauders Guild to get it. Because it gave me the, the Witcher Call, but it. I wonder what the skill is, actually. I don't remember.
actually it's getting late so let me go to my other character and i can actually also see it That's right, you can also do the summer event now that you're level 15. The summer? Is there a quest there? Oh no, you can't. Oh. You can't, it's lost for some reason. I wonder what else you need. Yeah, he has a quest. Do I go and get this quest at level 10? Is that what's going on here? Yeah, it's always level 10, level 15, level 20, level 25. What's that skill? Oh, it's the Tomahawk skill. Damn it, a nice big dick axe. Um, I forget the teleport. Oh, you, you can you can teleport to Swift Park, the place where you were before you you came back here. It's the place where you saw me. And Ale Point I didn't touch is anything all... over there. You, what? You didn't touch the big ass crystal. I didn't see a big ass crystal. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, well, y you can take the, the boat now. Remember that boat that I told you in at n near the fisherman's guild? Yeah. Yeah, you're, you're level 15 now, so now you can go there. The, the Lala won't be a racist anymore. <laughs> so fisherman's guild, and go down. That's the wrong one. Uh, that's the story quest. Remember what I told you? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah. True, 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 true. Show enough, show enough. Well, I keep doing that? Yes. So, uh. <laughs> Whenever you don't see a quest, there's always a reason. Um. Nine times out of ten, I'm just gonna. Assume that I'm blind, I can't see it. I think it's south now. Yeah. Alright, Ben. I 
I think uh, it's 3 a.m. I need to go to sleep. All right, bro. <laughs> I wish I did, but I gotta go to sleep. Yeah, man. All right, uh, see ya. I appreciate you. Bye bye. Later. Good night. Bye. And remember, main story quest and Marauder's Guild. Yeah. See ya. Oh, Amy's rating me. Amy, how was your stream? Tina's a snatch. Hello, friends. How are you? I, uh... Oh, was she, she was playing Resident Evil, wasn't she? I didn't actually see what she was playing. Or I forget, I need to, uh, OBS kept crashing. Gross. Disgusted. Yeah, I didn't actually, uh, we are playing, I assume you were playing Resident Evil, because he didn't finish it yet. Got the Aedas playthrough. What the fuck was Ada doing? Last and bo operation. Another delay? I'm all well aware of the shortage of skilled artisans, but this is insufferable. Easy, that's how the fuck you <laughs> She got naked a lot? Not surprising. Uh, messenger does not deserve to be burnt to my frustration. May I have your name? Uh, this proud maiden you see taking shape before you is the victory. First best new vessel to grace the dock since the calamity. We uh we may have lost the bulk of our ships that fateful day, but starting this beautiful uh starting with this beauty, we will restore the Maelstrom's fleet to its former glory. The victory is more than capable uh, more than a simple warship. It is a symbol of uh Lima begins to rebirth to the wreckage route uh with the coming of the several umbra era. Uh, there was this one shot of uh, under bridge. <laughs> hey, it's enough. Thus, we are uh, striving to complete the con uh, construction as swiftly as possible, even going as far as the higher veterans uh, shipwrights uh, from outside the Thalassocracy. Yet, such, even with such unprecedented measures, there are never enough hands to handle the abundance of tasks. Should you choose to linger at the docks for a time, there's no end of odd jobs for a hardworking adventure. Be you fair warned, there is no place for uh, layabouts or troublemakers. I need to figure out what the hell I'm gonna eat because I haven't done that in a while. We gotta duck that hoe. We need to get Amy Lark playing uh, one of these games with uh, the eye tracker. That was, I, I've been thinking about playing one of the uh, one of the more edgy games with an eye tracker. That'd be really funny. But all you guys would be uh, all you guys would be seeing is me staring at teams the whole time. <laughs> That's all that would happen.
respect for Booba. Have you guys ever played uh, Final Fantasy XIV or any kind of MMO before? Bro, fuck off. No one cares about you. I gotta be an innocent game. It's gotta be an innocent game that needs to be punishments. <laughs> you cannot time out any lucky fool. Played a little while years ago, and the most kind of intimidate me. They're extremely community based. Yeah, um, the only reason I'm playing currently, like, um, is because the homie Naomi, um, she wanted to play, and she intimidated me into it. I got bullied. play this goes into gamer mode every time I see someone playing this game we can went to gamer mode what do you mean spirits uh, and sort of require lifestyle changes to play a time to get the best stuff I'm not sure I care about all the best stuff I just want the stuff that makes me look cool like this is a fit like I'm okay with this I look cool like this I think I'm gonna get to level 17 before I decide to call it quick stuff. I think I had at least 300 days logged into WAP in 2007 or 2010. Yeah, that's. yeah. <laughs> I mean, it seems more competitive slash busy than I go for. I don't think it's that competitive. It didn't seem that competitive at first. The, the only problem that I've had with this game so far is that I don't know what I'm doing. But as soon as I figure out what I'm doing, it's not that bad. What? One intro. Oh, hi. You want to die.
if you may have what I meant. Yet yeah, my thing about this or MMLs usually is that they don't really feel like I'm doing it. I'm not doing brain correctly right now. Gotta sleep, man. Mm, what is mm, me? sake it doesn't feel like you're doing anything i mean i'm not i mean while i am playing the game most of the main attacks that you're doing aren't you playing the game they're just doing them by themselves character basically controls themselves and then every once in a while you get the plus special move. I'm not the sleepy kind of tired, I'm the forget everything about my last three thoughts tired. Fair enough. But I'll turn in. I mean, do what you do what you feel is best for you, bro. I will not be afraid if you decide to sleep.
the lurk is real. I'm giving ye the, to the count of nine to step back on that path and carry your veteran arse back down to wherever rocket crawled out of. Here yeah, it's uh, add up to me is with the Roman and the is and the we is the Rome and I don't care. If you want to fight or you want to fight. doing good. Getting kind of hungry, so uh, I think when I hit level 17, I'll be able to do whatever I want whenever I play the game next, assuming I do. Um, and I need to eat, so that's pretty important. At least I think it's pretty important. Could be wrong. Fuck you, dragon, that just flew over my head. Really gonna make me go the long way around? I really don't want to. Fuck. There we go.
the light ass set effect when you land it. Those pirates, did you? Are you the right kind of advantage for the aid? What's happened happening already? Jump the shipyard. Who did this to you? Pirates are nowhere, stuck and good. Get below, we're not prepared for this. We're gonna go fight some people. You're ready to fight some people. Never reckon to be this easy, still don't trust those slimy bastards, but their plan but their plan will work like a charm. Shut your trap, boy. This all be over. All that's left is now is to blow up the ugly pile of truffles and the splinters. How would you do such a thing? Do you have any idea what important it is, what it represents? And that's what makes it all the sweeter. Whatever it takes to knock some sense into your treacherous backstabbing son. Imagine a boy of mine giving up the pirate life to become a shipwright. Uh, building and bleeding a maelstrom vessel like that. What an under lame uh lim lands lim 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 lam 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 the widescreen ocean uh, need to take up with the self righteous shites. You're the one with no bloody sense, Doc. Don't you see? The pirates had their glory days, but the era is over. Uh Ad Burm never spoke to his, of his father. I never would have thought. The ship's simple, all right. Of everything, what went wrong with the world? I mean, to shatter it into a hundred thousand pieces. I mean to. Bear the tar of this boat is sea slug and making sure to harm the people. Make sure he doesn't harm nobody.
done. Must be getting no I'm in some green venture at uh, green adventure get the best of me. Now I'm just that nigga. One big bloody ship. Big and nasty looking. You made made that, did you? Okay. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm so close to level 17. Actually. Good night. Good with this marauding thing. With my marauder, what's it called? Where is this? It is up north. Lovely. How about I just go north?
across the way. That's not a jump that I can make. Ugh. Yeah, I'm getting real hungry right about now. It's cool that they gave us an uh, auto run now. Which I haven't been to yet. Western Lanus. Uh, yeah, that. I did. thing first. You can worry about the question a second. Touch the thing first. Touch it. Hey Beast, how you doing? Says, says she's still going right now as if she's playing the what it, still going what what is she doing
playing FF14. All right. Um, I think I'm gonna hit, I'm gonna hit. Oh Jesus Christ! I'm gonna hit uh level 17, and I'm gonna take a break for food because I haven't eaten all day. And then I'll uh, I'll probably just raid them. I need to go to the Marauder skin. Then I can just talk. And I'm out this bitch. side questing. Fucking final one, it's done. I keep using potions on accident.
Yeah, I learned Tomahawk. And I leveled up. Cool. I assume that we're going to go ahead and keep keep playing this. I don't. I didn't hate it as much as I thought I was going to, so it's fine. I apologize for the beginning of me not knowing what the fuck I was doing. It's I. I, I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. So, um. so yeah, we're going to go ahead and raid the homie Naomi. Uh, I'll probably be over there. Uh, hanging out with her um, after I finish eating. Um, yeah, because I, I haven't eaten all day. I've been here with you guys hanging out all day, so I need to go ahead and do that. And then I'll probably continue playing Final Fantasy fourteen with her. Um, so be sure to check her out. Uh, links to No Need uh, no need for Topics will be in the description below if you're watching this on YouTube. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and all that. And also, I'll try to put a link for Naomi in the, in the description as well. So, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.